What's up, my gamers? Welcome to another Let's Play Top of the Morning to You, brought to you by Fimphiliax, the YouTube channel. Isn't this it's the first great. Let's Play? Not a not another Let's Play? Yeah, I don't fucking know, man. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I mean, since we're recording, we'll go ahead and, and be a little bit awkward about it, even though we're just talking to each other. Uh, yeah, so we're going to be doing a Let's Play of this awesome game, Equestria Bound, which is a, a ROM hack of... Uh, an Equestria uh, of uh, an Earthbound ROM, which is the you know U.S. localization of Mother Two. Uh, it was really cool. Um, so we just it, we really felt like doing this Let's Play because we they had a cart of it at um, Winnie City PonyCon City. the other day. Yeah, we were having a lot of fun playing it, and we're like, damn, we you know this was a really soulful, really good uh, ROM hack. It's, it's like I I think it was made in like 2013, and then I edited some more. I think like final release like 2015 or something like that. So it's not like it's a new one. Um, you know, I mean, it's, it, it, you probably remember seeing it when they were editing it and releasing it back in the day. But it's but it it's really is cool. a hood classic. Yeah, it's a classic. It's really neat. I mean, so for example, I was going to start with before we actually start the play is yeah, I got the. It actually they have a manual that it comes with, which we're looking at right now. A little PDF we're looking at, uh, and it's cool. It's soulful. It feels like an old you know SNES manual. So they got Equestria Bound with their custom logo. They have the the first page of course is one of these little. Call you know, one or two paragraphs about like the backstory. It's pretty much the same thing you'd have for for like uh, Earthbound, but they you know a add the pony flavor to it. It's pretty much okay. There was Nightmare Moon. She got defeated in season one. This is this is set like um kind of like uh, so it's, it's, Twilight's not a princess. Yeah, you know, so it's not set after um, after season three. It's set kind of like in the middle of season three. So, you know, it's po my uh, point being it's post-season one. You know, there's the Elements of Harmony, there's the main six. They defeated Nightmare Moon and whatnot, but the, the idea is, okay, but, but maybe evil cannot be destroyed forever. There's going to be Nightmare Moon's going to return in the future. It's, uh, uh, it only takes place with the canon seasons. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> in fact, this game probably is canon. This is, this is the canon ending of, of season three to me. <laughs> this is, yeah, <laughs> if it wasn't rushed, it'd go a little something like, like this. this. Um, so yeah, they got controls and whatnot, looking like the classic old uh, manuals, very soulful. I like I like the little diagram with the arrows on it. Like this is what you actually saw in those ones. Um, then I bought you know select start R button. They they do include. I remember I don't I didn't actually look up what the original manual looked like um, for the U.S. Earthbound release, but I do remember looking at the manual before, like when I got it. And yeah, they definitely have a little the, the bike riding animation like on the page where they're talking about controls. I'm pretty sure they do if I remember right. I'm like, oh, that's kind of cute. Yeah, it's definitely trying to keep in that style. Um, so pretty much, pretty much you have buttons. These don't matter to anybody. Um, for anyone who's not familiar with Mother 2 or Earthbound, they do have some neat things in here they talk about, which will be a little bit later. But like this right here um, is the uh, uh, your, your status bar, your health bar during combat. And they use this little like, I don't know what that's called, this little like, you know, rolling thing. So the rolling meter actually has a game mechanic where like when you get healed or when you take damage, it doesn't just like say, oh, you now are at 50 hit points. It'll say like, oh, you're at 94 hit points, you took 44 points of damage. You'll see it slowly go like tick, 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 and start rolling down. And that matters. Cause like if you if you are gonna die, if you take like 100 points of damage, you can, it's not like an active time battle system, but it kinda is. Cause you can quickly go in there and like use a recovery item or use a healing spell or something like that. And if you do it fast enough, it'll heal you before you actually reach zero hit points and then you can recover from it. And there's, there's cute, cute little things like that in the game. Um, but the stuff that is unique for the game are, for the, for the edit, are these things talking about the characters. So they've done, you know, a full replacement on the characters. It's the, the, the Cutie Mark Crusaders plus Dinky is the idea is that Dinky's the main character and the other three are replaced with Cutie Mark Crusaders. Um, so they got a little backstory here. They do have a, a thing I noticed where they mention like her preferred weapon, it's like in the middle of this page, because her preferred weapon is throwing old male and they can't get smash hits, but they you know do lots of damage. Interesting right. thing there is that mechanic I'm pretty sure is is in the original game, uh, except it's kind of the opposite. In the original game, the main character's default like preferred weapons is melee weapon, and it's when you use a shoot or a throw weapon that you can't get the that you can't get the crits. But those are the um, those are like the, the alternate weapons, the nice primary weapon. And so I think they reversed that for Dinky since she's her default is a throw weapon and maybe there's alternate weapons that can do smash hits but that are gonna be melee ones, but they're not kind of her default. So that's a little yeah. bit different. You're telling me she can't smash? 
You know, it says they can't smash. I'm pretty sure I got a bunch of smashes when I was playing it the other day. I'm not sure. Uh, but th that would make sense, like, because that's the thing that, that people wonder about a lot. I didn't go look it up, and I don't really remember when I used to play the game. But, like, I, th I think maybe the shoot items instead of the, the bash items, they can't get smash hits, but they do higher damage or something. Something like that. There's some difference. I think they also have lower accuracy, I thought. But, um, so, yeah, characters replaced. Sweet, Sweetie Belle is, is Sweetie Belle. I don't know much difference with her. Uh, Apple Bloom replaces the character of Jeff, um, but her little thing they added here was that she's uh, she's an exchange student in Vancouver, in Canada. So she's up north in Canada as an exchange student. She's a, a engineering school, and uh, Scootaloo is is being trained You're a by. Yeah, well, she's yeah she got a little lightning cloud. <laughs> uh, Scootaloo is being trained in Cloudsdale by Rainbow Dash, learning how to fly better. So she might actually be able to fly. And and they have little things in here like. Um, you know, that's because at home you needed to have an inventor because in the in the game there's a character who's an inventor and he can like repair items and use gadgets and whatnot. So they had to do that. And in Scootaloo they have things like you know because Scootaloo has wings and a low weight she can't use equipment that's that's for non pegasi uh, cute things like that. That that's what explains why she can't because like in the original game it was like a martial artist guy because he's a martial artist he like he can't you know wear the armor and use the weapons he could just use like unarmed attacks and stuff. Um, but they explain that by saying, ah, Scootaloo's a Pegasus, and everybody else is not. That's why she can't use stuff, because she's a Pegasus. Um, I don't think there's anything special on here. There's just basic instructions that are common to the original game. Uh, and then they have the names. The names, which we'll see when we actually play the game, but of course they had to fill in different names, but you can rename your character. Sneed? Sneed? Where's Sneed? <laughs> Should we name someone I'm Sneed? Apple Sneed. Apple <laughs> Sneed. Yeah. Um, they got magic, you got your stats and whatnot. Yeah, and then here's where it mentions... Um, so Guts Turbine Smash it also chains, uh, slows the hit point meter, which is what I was talking about, that hit point meter, that um, when you get hit, your guts, you get, by increasing your guts, actually, that stat, you can, you can make it so that the, the meter actually rolls slower and slower, so by the end of the game, you can have a lot of time to recover, whereas at the beginning of the game, it doesn't necessarily matter as much. Well, they got typical status ailments you'd expect. Um, and then fighting. This is, it's back in the, the SNES era, but it's one that does not have the just totally random encounters that happen when you're walking in, like, in the overworld or in a dungeon, they actually have little enemies spawn, and then you have to, if you touch an enemy, that puts you into combat. Um, and they have a cute little thing where, uh, depending on how you touch an enemy, you can either get, it. so in, in some games, like, like in the original Final Fantasies and stuff, uh, there was just chances, because there was just random encounters, there was a chance for having a, um, like you can get a free attack, or the enemies can get a preemptive attack or something. In this one, it depends on if you touch someone from behind, you get a green swirl on your screen, and that means that you, you're guaranteed the first strike. If you're trying to run away and they touch you, then um, you're in trouble. You get a red swirl, and they get a guaranteed attack. And then uh, if you are if you touch them normally, you just get the regular swirl. So neat little things they included even back in the SNES days. Some other games did stuff like that too, but it's just cool that you start doing things. Very few, if any, back in the NES. I don't think really did much of these. Um, and I don't think there's anything else to say about these ones. Yeah, just talk about rolling hit points and guts again. But yeah, I just thought this was really neat. I wanted to look at this because it has, you know, a little manual for it. And I think that's cool, especially as, a, as far as, you know, hacks go. That's, that's, that's neat. Anyways, uh, okay, so let's see. I can boot up the cartridge now. We can actually play the game. Uh, what? Yeah. Uh, should I uh, should I throw up, like, an event thing so that people know we're recording? Or... Uh, if you want to, you do whatever you want. Okay. See, I told you this. Maybe you should put it in a, an actual, like, working recording channel. Maybe. That's fine, too. I want to see how bad the shit posting gets. <laughs> <laughs> I, the only thing I would want to avoid is like people coming in and asking, "Hey, what are you guys doing? Hey, what are you guys doing? Yeah, what's the Nintendo lot, right? sign? Yes. What's the Nintendo sign right there? Why yeah. is there an ape on the screen? I thought this was a pony game. Why is there an ape? Yeah. Why is who's Hulkin? Who's Hulkin? Why did they oh, have two stripes? It, it, so they didn't change like the opening title screen, but they did change this little piece of art, which is cool. They have a custom one for. Hey, check it out. Equestria Bound. Return of the Nightmare. Aw, oh, damn. I can't hear the sound. You can't hear the sound? Oh, yeah. It's pr I um, the scream, right? Yeah. Okay, here. You know what? Instead of that, let me just do this. Immersion ruined. <laughs> well, guys, it was a good Let's Play. There, can you hear it now? B. Yeah, there we go. All right, cool. Yeah, so this still says Earthbound. They didn't actually edit this one. I think this one's actually tough to edit, a lot of things. It also still says, like, you know, Shikisato Itoi did it, did it you know? Uh, he made ponies? Yeah. 
It's uh, that place the Earth Ponies try to get. See, it's a, it says name. he produced it right there. Even though it's showing the ponies walk around, he's yeah. the one who produced it. I always knew the Japs had good taste. Wait, I just realized, yeah, Earth, the term Earth Pony, does that mean Earth exists in Equestria? Yeah. It's not it's supposed to be dirt. Well, <laughs> Earth doesn't necessarily mean the planet Earth. It can just mean the word Earth, like dirt, soil, ground. I guess, but like, where does that come from? You know what I mean? Yeah, well, I mean, the, the etymology of it comes from the fact that it's the planet Earth, but like, I think that's true for a lot of words. You could, you could ask the question, be like, but this word technically came from Latin. Does that mean Latin exists in, in Equestria? <laughs> well, no. They're just I, maybe. What was the one language that Star Swirl wrote in, or whatever? Ponish? Old Ponish? Old Ponish, okay. Kind, kind of the equivalent Latin. of it, I think. Yeah. Pony Latin. Pony, Pony Latin, right. Now I just need to get a lust-provoking image to see what <laughs> Alright, well we're done with the little demo reel there. Hey. Uh, nice, fresh new save files and everything. So you start the game, we'll go with Gallop Speed, of course. And uh, they changed the titles. I think, um, I thought it would be neat. They did change this to Grass, which is kind of cute. But they didn't really change the other ones. Mm -hmm. I was disappointed. Like Grass. when we were playing it at Winnie City, I was hoping like Peanut would, instead of Peanut it would be like Applejack. Play. You know, they, I wish they didn't like you know Fluttershy, Pinkie Pie, Applejack, or have something related to them. But they didn't. But let's pick let's pick the orange one so that it's Applejack flavor. Was this at Winnie City? Yep. Yeah, this was at Winnie. They had a, a cartridge of it actually. It actually loaded on the cart, and you could play it on the one of the SNESs they had there. So I played through a bunch of it. Uh, I need to get into like the gaming rooms more at cons. It I was a cool on, gaming room. Yeah. I missed out on the MeriQuest thing at Harmony Con. Did you not go to it at all at Harmony Con? No, like the you know the actual box arcade thing. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, did you not go see it at all? You didn't get to play with no. the, the the cabinet at all. Oh man. No, I knew it existed, but like I never it never crossed my mind because I was always so busy that like you know I always forgot that it was there. Yeah. Are we just going with Dinky for her? Or? I'm just gonna go with the default for Dinky, yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Sweetie Belle on the other hand, it's Sweetie X. I like that. I, I do like that. Sweetie X. X. Um, default, of course, this is the default of Sweetie Belle. Um, you can be Sweetie Buy. You can be uh, Sweetie Bot, that's the default. Or you can put something else in there, but I was thinking Belle is fine. Unless you have another better meanie thing you want to use. Hmm. There's only one. There's only one I want to name in particular. Pokiska. Yeah, yeah. Pokiska. Uh Pokiska. Apple. And so Apple can be Apple Bloom. Apple Sneed. There. Yes. There's one letter missing. Apple from Tart. That. Apple Noi. Noi. <laughs> apple Apple. Apple Core and Apple Babs. Yeah. You know what? Let's let's do. Because it fits. Uh, it's a subtle joke, you know. Like, yeah. We we'll do Apple Sneed. Pokiska. Uh, and then Exalu. I, I like Exalu, Zalu, but yeah. I mean, you could say Scootaloo, yeah. Lualoo, Cheeraloo, Mangaloo, Lualoo, Dashaloo, Razaloo. But there's only one Lualoo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're we're gonna be Lualoo. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> oh, what's the pet's well, name? Wasn't the. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. I was like, wasn't the X meaning like that's what goes in the beginning thing? Yeah, yeah. so like we named her Foodaloo, so she's gonna name Foodaloo when you talk to people. Oh, uh, yeah, what did it need to be spelled? So, like, with the X there, now it's spelled like F U T A A L O O. Because, hmm? like, the thing on the side said X A L O O. Oh, so, no! Like, A's already yeah, there. you're right. Oh, oh you're shit! Right. You're right. Okay, yeah, yeah. I know, I know, Max. You saved our ship. I, I remember food. Oh, thank you. I didn't realize that. Yeah, because I was thinking it was Scooter. Yeah, okay. Uh, what's the, the pet can be Winona, Gummy, Hank, Opal, yeah, of course, Angel, Pee Wee, Faust, Winona. Like, what should the dog be? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, we're going to name him Taro. Uh. A joke only the deepest lore <laughs> she mm. will get. Alright, what's your favorite homemade <laughs> food? Apples. Some good old homemade apples. 
pie. Uh, grass, homemade grass. Ass. Is pizza an option? <laughs> no, but it's a good idea. I think I think it was in the original Earthbound. Like um, U.S. localization said, pizza was an option. You must be pizza. Can we do pizza. Yes, we can. Pizza. Is that, is, is that how to spell pizza, or is there a better way to spell pizza? I thought it was like P E E T. That's yeah, that's what I'm thinking of. Yeah, so I was like, this is not sound right. Yeah, I don't, I don't think we can't spell that pizza. though. Yeah, cause like pizza's not gonna spell right. Pizza. Z R Z R. Pizza. 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 Yeah. Right, pizza. pizza. Yeah. Uh, what's your favorite what's thing? Your favorite oh, friend. Mayors. Muffin. <laughs> yeah, I know. Mary's is gonna be it. Beam. Sunbeam. Friend. Muffin. Mother. Beam. Your favorite thing, mother. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll do mares, of course. All caps. Yeah, of course. We'll do, we'll do mares. Yeah. You put an exclamation point. Uh, nope. Okay, yes, thank you. Yeah, we can try that. Focus I cut. said no. Focus cut. Focus cut. Yeah, we have to go through all apples. Focus cut. Pizza. Yeah, ma uh, mares with the. Uh, uh, yeah, it looks good. Yeah, yeah that's with... powerful. Okay. I like me. Mayor's with the with the yeah. The note. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> You're singing it each time. Wow! 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 wow. What's that? Foot. <laughs> Foot. <laughs> Foot. Yeah. Foot. 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 Ponyville. Ponyville Equestria. Every yeah, time like... I see that sign, I just think about Chris Chan's OC. <laughs> <laughs> They've changed so much in this game. Like, yeah, as we were playing at Winnie City, I was like, I, I, I didn't remember anything about it. Like, I remember, like, like we were saying earlier, I remember that it came out, like, you know, eight years ago or something, this ROM hack. But I didn't ever really look into it, and I didn't realize just how soulful it was and how much they changed. They, they, they changed, you know, they did sprite replacements, and... With a lot of these types of hacks, you expect like, okay, they did some sprite replacements, they did some text replacements. Um, but this one just did such a good job replacing them, and such a good job of finding ways to make the various characters, whether they're canon, whether they're fanon, fit into stuff. And that's what made me like want to play it a whole bunch at Winnie City. That's what made me want to go do this Let's Play. Was like, this, you know, we should play through this. I, I just for myself, heck, I want to see the rest of the game and how they replaced everybody. Derpy. Oh, it's therapy. Yeah, I want to sleep with therapy. And this was something like like we noticed this immediately when I was playing. Um, originally, was was like, wait a minute, Derpy's here. This is supposed to be your sister's room. Why is Derpy? And it's like, well, because they they had to figure out how to make the fan and fit just right for the characters. So they actually like reversed the roles of certain characters and then changed a bunch of the script for it. Um, and so apparently, this is your sister. I guess I don't know. I, didn't, I don't remember Dinky having a sister, but. Um, maybe I'm not big in the dinky lore. Yeah, it's a, it's one of those library colors. <laughs> like amethyst, something star. Hmm. I think you have a different dialogue now. <laughs> I want every time before you go out, they're like, "But did you remember this?" So you just have to keep going back. To you should keep going back, <laughs> going back. <laughs> Actually, you don't have to talk to it. If you talk to that, she makes you go upstairs. And like normally, you're like wearing your pajamas, and so you like go upstairs and put on your clothes to go out. Uh, you don't have to talk. You can just leave. Stuck with Taro. Oh, besides ponies, dogs also sleep at night. Why aren't you asleep? And they really got the high tech balloons out here. Those yeah, they got, they got the night. balloons to the police cars, the little guards mares instead of the uh, police officers. But yeah, it's cool. Like the horror, the horror, you know. It's things like that that started making me realize this was going to be a much more fun uh, hack than I thought it was going to be. Yep, and there's the, the good old guy saying, I'm going to be the first one to be there. He's just walking in place. Thank you, Rose. Look. <laughs> Trixie is back. Yeah, Trixie, the uh, which I found pretty fast, but 
Trixie is, is is the replacement for the gang leader in Ponyville. <laughs> in the original game, it's got a gang leader and a bunch of ruffians you have to let go stop. And they replace that with Trixie and her fans. Her rabid fans. It's nighttime o'clock in a cluster. And they replaced the, uh, where's the, um, yeah, the, the dollar sign is replaced with a, they, they edit it ever so slightly to look like a B, it's a bit sign. It's equestrian bits that you have. Oh, it's Daring Do. That's right. It doesn't look like it from here, but I, I figured out she's Daring Do later, so that's who it is. Meteor explode. It's a real mess. Made that billboard herself. Yeah, House of Fame Adventure Daring Do. <laughs> oh. What does she look from the side? Yeah, see now you can tell now you can tell it's Daring Do from the side. Although maybe it's nighttime, but her um, her like clothing is a little little bit dark too dark, I think. A little bit wrong color. <laughs> might might be a palette thing, it might be a nighttime thing, I don't know. And Di Diamond Tiara is the annoying fool who lives next door and causes trouble for you throughout no, the game. No, you are not friends. <laughs> no. No, one, no one likes that bitch. <laughs> oh, way out, get my... Oh, shouldn't you be out doing blank blank things? You just the important ponies. Okay, see you later. I think, yeah, I think it's just the same thing. All right, well, we can't get through. Dinky's going to take care of it, don't worry. We're not Dinky. Uh, Diamond Tiara is going to take care of it. Dinky should just go home. World's longest walk of shame. Oh, there she is. Uh, no. <laughs> <coughs> Fuck that. I ain't going to bed. I ain't tired. Later that night. Turn the lights on. We'll talk to Dr. Derpy. Want to talk to us, please? Oh, yeah. Silver, silver spoon. Silver, now we're talking. Silver spoon. Oh, you like? Yeah. Oh, silver spoon got glasses. Yeah. Yeah. He is a top Philly. Top five Phillies of all time. Uh, no. Yeah, we'll go with her. And Toto's so bring unreliable. He's unreliable. But you gotta bring him. And you gotta beat the shit out of every animal you see. Alright. And we're back to having our saddlebags. Okay. I've already gotten the item from from Mother Derpy's room. We've already equipped it. I think she'll I think she tells you like, hey, remember to equip no, she's not here. Good luck. You're my courageous little filly. Here's a muffin. Oh, cool, she gives you a muffin. Derby, one of the top five ponies of all time. Like that's a, that that's the reason they changed out for that. Is normally your sister in the game is like your uh, your storage. You can store stuff with her, and then later on in the game she tells you like, oh, she's working for the like postal service. She, she she can like deliver stuff to you if you want her. And so that's why they replaced your the role role of mother and sister is they made Derpy be the her because that way she, she's your mother, but she's the one who does the postal service deliveries. I wish Derpy was my mom. Diamond Tiara, talk to Taro. Yes, we want Taro with us.
And we get the save system in the, Oh no, we can't talk to him yet. Alright, we don't get the save system yet. Oh, now, now, now you get the save system. system. Okay, okay. <laughs> Bing. How's it going, champ? I deposited thirteen thousand dollars in your bank account. <laughs> Yeah, I deposit 30 bits in your bank account. Do you have an ATM card? Yeah, so if you want to save the game, you call your dad. And he's like, yeah, what's up? Anyway, I deposit $13,000 in your bank account. And then he, uh, he lets you save. All right, now enemies can spawn. Woo And we Wait, get some what? we get some groovy music. Oh there they are. Yeah, yeah. there it is. Dog! Dog! What the dog? I've never seen the Ooh, oh, they changed the music! And... Diamond Tiara made a snide remark. No. That's, that's good. Whoa. I don't remember learning magic powers already. Ah! I abuse the game mechanics. While you're flashing an invincible, enemies, uh, and you can't get into combat with them, and oftentimes you can position yourself just right by walking through them, that when it does reactivate you, you're technically on, like, the backside of their hitbox, and then you get to get a free attack on them, even though they're not trying to run away from you. Any points for the 31? Eat a muffin. Red roll. 30 hit points, whereas muffins are like nothing, right? Six hit points. I think he ate the muffin. But they're delicious. <laughs> Dog. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you don't normally learn any, you know, you don't learn life but magic at level 2 in the base game. I think that's a change. Uh, Diamond Tiara used Dinky as a shield. Dinky was going to slaughter every stray dog in this neighborhood. Yeah, before like, like Dinky, your job is to go up to the top of the hill. Okay, but wait a minute. There's a dog. <laughs> that <laughs> snake. I'm gonna stomp on it. <laughs> Instead of going up the up the hill, she just goes to the neighbor's yard and beats up their dog, goes to the other neighbor, kills their dog, goes to the other neighbor. Dinky, Dinky, you're supposed to go up to the, the hill. She's like, yeah, I'm getting there. Yeah, they're in the way. One XP. Oh, I see what she... Oh, dude, oh it's, it's, it's a silver spoon. She's up there and nodding off. Ah, a real mare <laughs> among mares. Yeah, that that's it. when I think of um, daring do a real mare among mares is what I think. Goodbye, Taro. Thank you, unreliable dog. <laughs> it's hot. I thought she was going to say, do something else with her, but yeah, go to sleep is fine, too. <laughs> <laughs> Even doctrinated more fillies into your party. Ah. Uh, sure, we'll say we do. Ha, I knew it, you're schizo. Oh, no, now I actually, now I actually do hear it. <laughs> Behold, the princess of the night. You know, I always knew she was smaller than her sister, but this is ridiculous. Right. Yeah. Ah, so she she became Nightmare Moon again, and she's like, I wa I wasn't weak this time. I did fail, but I wasn't weak. Okay. Yeah. 
I was totally not owned for everybody listening. I, I'm not owned. My sister laid waste to the land. We used the last of our power to assume a form that would escape the nightmare's notice. So she turned herself into a flea and went back in time. Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Princess Luna joins the party. I think it says that in a sec, actually, doesn't it? Yeah, Princess Luna joins you. Ah, oh, sweet. Okay, we gotta go take these little fillies home before we go out on our important quest to visit Twilight Sparkle in the Tree Brewery. Yeah, also, not, not, at the, well, it's the end of season four the tree gets destroyed, I guess. She still has the tree breary. Anyways, I was going to say more evidence that this is mid-season three. My status. I'll eat another cookie. Eat another muffin. Even, uh, uh I'll save it. Oh no, it's an evil nightmare. Ah, King Sombra. Oh, she's so sad. <laughs> she's so sad about it. Look at her. Why, why can't she take slavery with a, with a smile? Travel back in time, light these children on fire, and then go home. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of our plan, wasn't it? <laughs> the nightmare. Ponies who have evil in their heart, and even animals who become violent. Oh, like those dogs! <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I swear, dogs, your dog were violent. They were just evil. Yeah, they were was, evil dogs. Yeah, it was under the nightmare. Your dog has come under the nightmare's, nightmare's influence. It's been swayed by evil. We must kill it. I throw envelopes at it until it fell over. Yeah, have you girls been all night? This is your fault, isn't it, Nick? Wait until your mother... See, this is something else like this. this is, I remember pointing this out to you at Winnie City. It was like, she's like, wait until your mother hears about it. And I thought, okay, you should come here and it should be her father, Filthy Rich, right? But she says mother. In the normal game, this is the father sitting here. Instead, you can tell, like, that looks like a mare model. They replaced it with a mother, and you talk to her, and she's like, oh, hello, Miss Who's good to see my daughter's friends. Um, so they replaced her with, like, a Rule 63, like, there, look at it. It's, it's a mare version of Filthy Rich. It's not it's not actually, um, what is it, Spoiled Rich, whatever uh, they knew. Uh, that was probably the later seasons that it showed up, but still. Um, yeah, kind of awkward, like, why didn't they just make it be Filthy Rich? I don't know. <laughs> Yeah. Filthy Bridge was really like needs correction. Beat the shit. Yeah, she's whoosh, waxing. Ah, <laughs> uh, the nineties. Good times. But then, but then she says like, my husband. So maybe that's supposed to be Filthy Rich, and it's supposed to be. I, I don't know, dude. Um, dude, Filthy Rich just has so much money. He's got like a million side bitches. I suppose so. By the way, rip Princess Luna. Yeah, cause like a minute ago she's like, wait until your mother. Oh, I guess maybe the mother she's talking about like um, a silver spoon, or maybe she's talking to me or something like that. Maybe that is supposed to be yeah. regular filthy rich. I guess so. It really looks like, especially from the front, it does not look like filthy rich. It looks like a freaking. Oh. Yeah, Luna. So I ever talk about with talk about Princess Celestia getting a job, but this is like the ultimate job right here. Cool. 
The library Maybe and the Tony child. Bear. I'm a retard, but you're the most intelligent filly I know. Granted, she only knows three fillies right now. Yes. <laughs> and two of them just got the shit beat in Wait, wait, she said, she said, oh, let's watch, we'll repeat them. She said, Twilight Sparkles in the library. That makes sense. And she said, she okay. take the elements uh, with, oh, wait, in the story calendar. She said, when you're there, speak to Princess Celestia. For a sec, I thought she said, when you're in Ponyville, talk to us. Like, what? Why is Celestia in Ponyville? No. Oops, I said yes again. Well, just just to make sure that we have it, I want to make sure that Twilight is in the in the library. No, I don't speak need you to repeat to it. All right, Lovely. don't approach us fast. Here, take the element. The dormant element. Oh, she's oh, dead. I did say food a little there. You know, that was weird. It, I thought it did say that, didn't it? Trippy. World's slowest club beat. <laughs> As it becomes morning. <laughs> Look at that, the music. Oh, this is cute. Nice. And of course, you gotta have your picture taken. But because this is Equestria bound and not Earthbound, it's photo finish. <laughs> ah, yes, that pose, <laughs> the lighting, the location. It's brilliant, brilliant. I am photo finish, the past year's foremost fashion photographer. It's time to make the magic. Earlier today, an uh, eccentric photographer was seen taking pictures of children outside <laughs> That's their true. household. <laughs> yeah. Good point. In a witness testimony, he was created to just spun down from the sky and just took a picture and spun back up. Thank you, your dad. I deposited 35 bucks. Yeah, you got, like, half a hundo in there, you'll be good. Buy a hamburger. You're American. Or, uh... Equestrian. Sounds good. Equestrian. <laughs> I'll fix you some pizza, and you should go to bed. Mmm. Pizza and then bed, or <laughs> Yeah. I mean, haven't you eaten, like, a pizza? I mean, at Winnie City, we all had Chicago pizza. Yeah, yeah. But you want to go to bed right after that. Yeah, she's, I don't a, wanna she's a girl in Philly. Right she's a girl in Philly. That's how you That's how you do it best. Let's go see what the dog has to say. Yeah, the unreliable dog. Stay. All right. Yeah, I, I am loving the, the My Little Pony music in town. This is nice. The suburbs of Ponyville. Kill some more Paris Sprites. Let's kill some Paris Sprites while we're at it. Yeah. Well, you can see the evil look in their eyes. They're under the influence of the nightmare. They're at it. Gotta Shoot, kill they, they were going right for us. We had to kill them. <laughs> we had to put them down. Oh, they left me a present. I wonder if anyone's gonna be like walking to town later and they just see like animal corpse after animal corpse. It's like Golden Oaks <laughs> Library. I know this looks like a tree, but it's actually the library. It's a great place to learn stuff. Like this, this is neat, right? So normally this is the library in the original game, but they just replaced it with they just like hacked in some tree sprites tiled against each other. But it's cool. It's it's the Golden Oaks Library where Prize Sparkle is. <laughs> Me taking over Equestria. Uh, but I'm not going to. I, I have far more important things in the stake than the, the the fate of the world at stake. I, I have to look after my library. Spike needs a bath. Uh, Discord and the Changeling Queen. Okay, so this is you know, after after season two, we thought they weren't safe to keep in their current place, so we took our element and moved it. They replaced it six points of power throughout the land that will hold any pony who wants to keep normal Equestria out. Okay, so good, good plan. And then I use my to teleport mine directly to one, so I don't, I don't know where I put it. I put it somewhere, which in retrospect was a bad idea. Yeah, bad idea. Pinkies is in Ponyville. It's on top of a tall hill, just west of here. Yep. Yeah. 
So what do we do? We hid them all places. Where? None of us know. I'll have to go research it. Got the time map. <laughs> you could return it in a few years. Hmm. Time map. Any map. Magically changes to fit whatever time you're in. And you can view the map quickly. Uh, yeah, so we are Ponyville! Well, Ponyville North, rather. Wow, Dinky's really rocking in the spring. Yeah, I like the little sprite. Ponies are real. Far, far to the south. <laughs> we live in a society. This class is all about convenience stores. <laughs> oh, it's that guy. Okay, at least this is quiet. <laughs> The tennis guy. Bathrooms in an RPG? It's more likely than you think. There was it a magic butterfly. It was a flutter pony. Nidax. Nidax. The magic butterfly made Dinky of Nidax. 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 I'm digging the music though. Dirty pony. <laughs> oh, you gotta, you gotta go to the Hyatt. Yeah. Yeah. Philly hideout, Mr. Baseball Cat. Which is a really oh they they changed fetlocks instead of arm. There we go. Now It can interfere with Pegasus play? Uh, that, I think that just means that Scootaloo can't equip it. <laughs> Sorry, Scootaloo, you can't wear this hat. Begin with a grown mare. Aww. He's trying to get it in. Okay, get out of my way, NPCs. Oh no. Oh no, we're getting soft locked. Get out of the way! Well, guys, it was a good let's play. Um... Okay, so... ah, she's out of the way, she's out of the way! <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, oh, nice. Alright, so yeah, if we go up here, you just won't be allowed in. I think, is there like a poli uh, policeman guarding it or something? It's an XP. Oh, no, it's locked. I think you go up the area and it's just locked and you have to get the key, which is why you need to. We'll need to, we'll need to defeat Trixie. <laughs> Dog is like fighting for its life and you're just beating it senseless. There we go. No, I'm not. Keep dodging. Now I'm beating it senseless. No, it keeps dodging. This dog, I'm like, dude, this dog's coming right for me. What is it? It's running away from me. I'm trying to hit it. No, no, he's, he's, he's attacking me. He's threatening me. He keeps running away. I keep trying to hit it. He's totally threatening me. He needs to be put down. He keeps running away and just trying to escape. 
Come here, you mutt. Excuse my magic. Hey, maxed out. Oh, it's Flim and Flam! Tr Trixie tried to break in. Alright, so Flim and Flam can't use their shed because Trixie broke into the shed and messed the place up. <laughs> See, Trixie broke in and now uh, you guys have to be homeless. No, no, no. The they can't. The they can go get a. Hood. They, they just don't because they're, you know, they're full and flame kind of scumbags. They're, yeah, they're trying to be super cheap about it. Hey, let's dig around the trash can. Uh, let's see here. Here's a cupcake. Yeah, a trash can cupcake. Let's take that. Oh, and like this. Uh, so this is supposed to be a drug. I'm pretty, pretty sure this is supposed to say drugstore, but they changed the sign to say dessert shop. So that's that's another good hack. I think this is the hamburger store. Oh, you're right. It's like fast food store or something, probably. Or hamburger or oh. something. That's right, kids. Go down to your local McDonald's, eat as many McDonald's as you can. Well, no, and get, you'll kids, all your go, go, go to McDonald's and always evaluate the price of everything versus the amount of calories that it has in it and buy the most efficient food. So ask for a bunch of mayonnaise packets <laughs> and just eat the mayonnaise Oh yeah, packet. cupcakes, titty cocoa, cup of coffee. Smile, smile. Mmm. Dessert shop wagey mayor. Uh, this is the drugstore. It just says store instead of drug. I don't know if it says drugstore in the base game or not. It might well, not. It says drugstore no, right there. Rufini the dog. I'm being possessed by the spirit of the mod dev. Oh, so this one instead of the, the original game developer. Normally you talk to him and he's like, I'm the original game developer and uh, he talks to you. This is the mod developer. Sometimes he is a lot path in the original. Did you speak at Twilight Library after Luna <laughs> passed on? You didn't do that in Earthbound. Pay attention to the story or you might get lost. Now it's going to come around like a dog again. This is one dog you're not allowed to beat the shit out of. <laughs> We'll just see about that. So we got this. So what can we do? A bulk rate box, a yo-yo, baseball cap, cheap bracelet. That's an expensive bracelet. Oh, you hurt his feelings. I don't care. Same, no, same person. Dang it. No, I want to talk to the person on this side. Have a cold remedy. We need to get some more money out of the ATM. Oh well, no, yeah, the ATM's free. I would say I didn't want to use the the phone there because it's a pay phone, but the ATM is always free. I'll use the ATM here to withdraw some of that money that our father gave us. This truly is a utopian society. They don't charge you four dollars for a withdrawal. Okay, and now I can use that. So, I, wanna, I wish we knew the stats. I think Bolt Rate Box would be better, but you can also get a yo yo. I don't know if it's better or worse. So, I think Bolt Rate Box is like higher blunt damage, and then you want the yo yo later for people that use uh, shield. Because it, it, I think it goes through shield damage. What the hell are you talking about? I don't know. I don't, that, none of that sounds right. Anyways. Uh. Yeah, it's an interesting store though that like they'll they'll sell you a bulk rate box and then buy back your unused envelopes. That's kind of neat. And by unused, I mean I used them in combat a whole bunch. But that might be true. I didn't. So you're saying the yo-yo can the, the yo-yo can go through shield? You think, huh? I think it has a lower stat, but it by <laughs> like the reason it's even there as an option is. So you can get past enemies that spam shield. But, you know, that's that's lame. Just beat the shit out of him. Look, it's Chris Chan. He's, he's the mayor of the sun. Check with Nurse Redheart and she'll release your friend. Aw, oh, Nurse Redheart sounds so nice. What, th this is Chris Chan? Chris Chan's yeah, OC? same colors. <laughs> okay, yeah, I can see that. <laughs> now, what is this? Trixie's wild fan smash it up. She locked the shack to the north.
swarms of Pinkie Pie. Thank you, Folgate. Very cool. Bureaucracy. Pony style. Hey, Colgate's in here too. Wow. Very busy man. But it's definitely the same one because she's talking about how Mayor Mayor bugs are a whole bunch. It says the same thing that the other mayor said. I mean, it didn't if say only, the exact same words, but... If only they used the fresh breeze movement when COVID happened. <laughs> Yeah, I just like to see her stop me. Oh, okay. No, this guy will. This will stop you. Okay, so she won't. The, the, the other mayor that says, I'll stop you, but I'm too lazy, she won't. This mayor who says, I will stop you, won't. But the actual guard's pony, yeah, he'll stop you. They actually did something for us. Yeah, the guard's ponies do stuff all the time. Not on the show. Yeah, they do. They guard stuff. The... They do? Yeah. It's dogs how, how did the dog know about that? <laughs> did you know that you can buy weapons at a drugstore? I knew about it. <laughs> can you not use them against me? Maybe the other ones, huh? Ponyville Groomer located? No. So this is a hint house, which is every town has one. It's just it's just like orange colored house, very conspicuous. Um, and the neat thing about in this in this mod is the hint is Faust. It's a Faustacorn. Wow. She's tall. Yeah, because Faustacorn knows knows everything about what's actually going on. So she's like, well, I know how the story is supposed to play out, and I can just give you a hint on what to do next. It's kind of cool. And if you say no, she goes, oh, wow, you came just to see me. That's really nice. Yeah, so a little affiliates from alone. I don't think you can... Well, you know what, if I go up, I kind of want to go up there and talk to her. Now. Yeah, yeah. Because I remember that too, right? Like, they're just guarding their house. And yeah, well, because she's like, you know, come back later and I can show it to you. Um, and I, I don't know when you can see it. I think you might be able to go see it right now. I don't know. I wonder if Equestria Bound has been released yet. Nice. Anyways, I'm gonna stop talking to every single person in town and let's see, let's go check out the save at the hotel. Get some more money from dear old dad. Ooh, digs the trash. Oh. What? There wasn't edible food in this trash can? Oh, the, the hotel music is the uh, Fluttershy's night, good night sound. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, as we know, we need to um, stop Trixie and her rabid fans so we can talk to the mayor. So let's go start taking them on and seeing if we can get some good experience. Right. We need to stop the Trixie fans? Yes. You want to meet the green Every single She's one. behind the arcade, practicing her tricks. Well, She's going to show up Twilight Sparkle. There she is. Well, we need to stop at least half of the Trixie fans. And here's one they of her... have to annoying... take care of themselves. <laughs> yes. <laughs> True. <laughs>
Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Offense went up by four. And I learned hypnosis. Can I sneak this guy? Oh, that's not an actual guy you talk about. Get in the line. Oh, yeah, you can fight this guy. <laughs> so this is also, this is definitely like retuned. Oh, this is pretty powerful. Um, from the base game, I think, because I remember the base game fighting these guys out. Like, this place was dangerous. One thing I noticed was that when I encountered that first guy, I encountered him and then we just fought him. Uh, I think in the base game, I remember in the base game, because the it can't happen when you encounter somebody, if there's other sprites on the screen, they can rush up and join the fight. Certain enemies will do that, certain enemies won't. But in the base game, these enemies definitely would. And this, this area, especially for an early area when you're at low level, was really tough for a lot of people. And like you come down here, you engage one of them, they would all run up there and you'd be in a fight with like three, out, three on one. Um, and so it looks like they might have edited it in two ways. One being, they made it so that they don't do that. They must, you know, flag them as, hey, you know, don't join combat. So that way we want to fight one at a time. It's much easier. Uh, but also like the stats of these things seem a lot more tame. Like these guys die in like two hits. They don't hurt me that much. Because uh, I recall whenever I played the, the base game that it's like you have to really level up quite a bit and, and be it's kind of dangerous. Whereas here it's, it's not really. How much does Muffin do? Muffin or cupcakes are 50. 100% not made of anything questionable. And bread roll's like 30? 30. 30. I, eat, yeah. I eat a bread roll. Who's this? <laughs> Walking XP. The obsessed fanboy. Uh, now we're getting some groovy music. Damn, Dinky is just flooring these guys. Mm hmm. Hey, pizza! Hey. Open soon. Let's get in a fight with these guys. See, yeah, that's more like it, having them join the fight. Eh. The enthusiastic oh, point being the Yeah. We got Snips, Snails, and then Ronald McDonald as your enemies. I mean, my offense and defense is at like zero now. I mean, you don't really need offense. You have a giant box you can just drop on him. Let's fight this guy. I want some of those old babies. I want old baby. Offense went up by four again. That's what I want. Let's see. I'm going to go to the hotel, get some more money from dear old dad, call him up, get some money, go buy that uh, armor bracelet from the shop. That'll be good. Hey, Dad. Deposit a hundred, hundred and five bucks. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> Big money. Like the armor bracelet, even is it better than the Mr. Baseball cap? Well, oh, the bracelet goes on your felt ox, not on your head. Oh, okay. yeah. It went from, defense went from 10 to 15. Pretty good. Now, before I actually go fight some other guys, I am going to go, uh, I mean, we can go recover. So I want to go back home to do a quick cover, but also because I need to, I want an excuse to go back on the hill and talk to Daring Do and seeing if we can do the next stage of her little dialogue and questy stuff. I'm surprised these snakes aren't afraid of me yet. Oh, there we go. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, let's, let's see if I can do that to dogs. <laughs> Yeah, 
Pinky has come on, no chill. Come on, dang. All right, probably one more level, and then I can just kill runaway dogs at will. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, they only do one damage to me, and I can kill them one hit. I'm surprised that uh, they don't just whoosh, for me. Pair of spray. Dang, they don't—they don't do it either. Also, very little, very little XP though. So. Die, snake. Ah, yeah. So she's not outside anymore. <laughs> We can probably go inside and talk to her. Hey kid. Hey wanna kid. Come to my basement? Why don't why don't you come to my basement? Oh, I see you're still kind of shy with me. That's okay. <laughs> this my is a creepy is fucking condition. yeah. Yeah, you come deeper into the hole that I dug in my basement. You know, no one could hear you screaming all the way out here. Let's get further in, further in. Yeah, I just thought that was a fun fact. Uh, damn. Yeah, huge hole, huge treasure. I'll show you, but you're the only one. Don't tell anybody about what we do down here in this hole. This great treasure. Okay. Yeah, cool. So we gotta see the statue. Let's see how much we gotta go back and talk to her. Did she say the same thing? Yeah. Alright, so Daring Do is digging big holes in the middle of her, like, crappy, rundown, dilapidated shack. And she, and she has a hobby of making billboards. Oh yeah, this is definitely sticking with the, uh, with the cannon and the fanon right now. Yeah. I, I remember that. That was the, uh, the, the, the Daring Do billboard making hobby Tumblr, right? Yes. It was the second most popular one, right behind the Molestia blog. But and Little Miss Rarity. Yes. All right. Well, I'm glad we saw that. I'm, I'm glad that we got taken to the uh, Daring Do's basement hole. I'm very curious of her to show you her hole. Now let's go home and have some pizza before we go beat up Trixie. Ah, now they run away from me. And yeah, now they're afraid. I abandoned the muffin. No. Dang, these dogs are still... they still want to fight. The dogs? Of course they do. That's all they do. They howl and they fight. And they die. <laughs> oh, another one of these things. That's all I have in my inventory, probably. It's like a bazillion muffins from these things. All these Paris sprites. Let's check. Is there a sort button? I don't remember if there's. No. Okay, I have one, two, three muffins, three cupcakes, and a bread roll, and a juice box. You also look cute while drinking it. Oh, that's a nice little addition. Let's get some pizza. Get you some pizza and you go to bed. <laughs> I got a 
I talk to mom? Maybe I'll talk to mom. Maybe she has something to tell me. Yeah, you can check out therapy. <laughs> Six XP? Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna get that by killing dogs. I'll have to go. I need bigger meat. I'll have to go beat up some foals downtown at the arcade. Starts going slow right around here. You get slow when you're walking around the arcade with these guys spawning. Oh damn, you got all three of them to hang out. Is it big XP? Big XP? No. Damn. Need a lot of XP. Let's get another another big fight. You have not leveled yet. Well, I, I needed 97. It's like 40 and then 20 something. So this this will do. It. Damn, dude! All he's doing is removing all my offense and defense. Like this offense good defense going down. Like my offense is only 18 right now. So reducing it by one is kind of a big deal at this level. I mean it's a big deal at every level. I don't know the calculations that go into this game. Ooh, normally it has a sign on here that says it's an arcade. Yeah, they removed the sign. Um so yeah, removing you know one offense is a pretty big deal. <clears throat> and similarly, uh it's not just because it's a, a, a high percent, like I only have 18, therefore one out of 18 is a lot. But, uh, yeah, we'll throw away a muffin. Okay, I never cleaned out my muffins. But, like, when you level up, you only gain, you know, one offense, two offense. And so I don't know the calculations of going to the game, but I'm pretty sure that they're a lot... Um, they're very sensitive to these, like, actual values you have. This guy said he's talked to you. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Sounds like a real whiner to me. The great and powerful CC. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Just peeing in her smoothie. <laughs> Yeah, see, they only get like 13 XP each. How much do I need XP to next level? 176. Probably not gonna get to next level before I fight Trixie. I'll just fight Trixie. I'll hit a bread. I got like so many cupcakes, like. I'll be able to defeat Trixie, no problem. 
Oh, Trixie. Come one, come all! Witness the power of the great and powerful CC! Can't you at least tell Trixie oh. your name? First boss battle. Ah, and she still has the, the oh. original music. Yeah. Oh, she has a shield. That's weird. I don't remember her having magic. Oh, well, of course, it's Trixie! It's Trixie, she Right, really yeah, the, in the original game, the guy didn't have magic, of course, but it's Trixie, so she has magic. And she's great and powerful. Trixie! She doesn't have the space for the E on the end of her name. In the... Uh, she became tame. I have tamed the great and powerful Trixie. The Robo Ursa. Like that's just a ball. <laughs> yeah. Destroyed. <laughs> Damn, easy mode. It really is pretty easy right now, yeah. Oh, Trick is more great oh, and powerful. Oh, no. The great and powerful Dinky. Oh, all right. GNPD. Dinky, you become stronger than Trixie. Your adventure is just beginning. Great and powerful Dinky has a nice ring to it. And as I recall, I think you can come back to her and she'll keep, she like heal you for free. You don't have to go stay at the hotel. You look much stronger. You have to rest. Yeah, you have to rest. Yes. Ring. All right, and that should have fully. Dang, I keep pushing the wrong button. Yeah, fully healed me. And now all the, the tricksy hooligans are just like, oh yeah, yeah, you're cool. Yeah, he's gonna just, yeah. 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 <laughs> no problem here. Yeah? Yeah? He ran up to you and said that. Oh, yeah, that guy, uh, whenever you're walking through, he accosts you and he automatically talks. You don't, it's not talking. You, like, I don't do the, use the talk action. He just walks up and talks to me. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Wait, let's go talk to the mayor and say, hey, mayor, I, uh, I defeated the great and powerful Trixie. Mayor, Mayor is waiting. Oh, that's the guy that sells quills and couches. Made her cry, cleaned her clock, Dog? and made her promise not to cause any more trouble. We fight the fight, we talk the talk, we suck the cock? Side. I want to see her side. Oh, she has no cutie mark. Well, Cover all politicians are just talentless hacks right. anyway. Well, let's so. see. When I talk to her on the other side, maybe she's like her toy, right? Maybe she's like the toy. It's the only one on one side. No, no, no. I, talk to her. Uh, I don't think I can get to her on the other side right now. Oh, well. <laughs> out of my way, out of my way. Coming through the little filly that cleaned uh, Trixie's. Clock <laughs> is coming through. I don't know if you know about Dinky, but she's a filly that can clean a clock. <laughs> go ask, go ask Daring Do about it. 
Daring do is daring do. I, I was busy cleaning her clocks in her in her basement hole for hours the other day. Hey kiddo, heard you were cleaning some clocks. Here's three hundred dollars. Dude, proud of you. No, Mister, I don't need three hundred dollars. My dad puts three hundred dollars in my bank account daily. <laughs> That's not a lot of money to me. Uh, let's uh, let's eat a muffin. Actually, I think you can sell items in the game. You can go to the drugstore and ask them, Hey, hey, drugstore, do you, like, you want to buy a muffin from me? And they'll just, like, give me a dollar for it, a bit for it. Uh, let's see, Flim and Flam. Okay, each does the same thing. I can go up here, though, and use it. Got some goods. Key to the shed. What does it say? Check key to the trip. That's not... Okay. That's a, a, that's a mistake on the address for the, the string there, but all right, we'll use it. Wow, you opened the door. Alright, here's a trinket for good luck. It's the travel charm. I get Damn. nothing. Nothing? Really? <laughs> I thought I thought it gave like uh, at least one I just check some paralysis, it, all right. It's a it's a real flim and flam item. It, it really do is. Anything. <laughs> Another well used bet. Alright, now we gotta go through the first dungeon. Ants. Slugs. Oh slugs. <laughs> Now, these guys get a lot of XP. Well, there were a whole four. Yeah, but... Still. Oh. Rat. Rato. Rowdy Mouse. Damn, twice. Damn. Crit City. Yeah, they get... Big, they, they are... Their thing is, like, they do, like, one damage, they don't crit, but they have a really high chance to crit. When they do, they do huge damage. Um... Yeah, I'll go ahead and she's magic. Trot sandwich. Let's eat that. I can move fast now. Look at me go. Speedy. This rat is going to kill you. No. I'm not going <laughs> to die to a rat. Okay, so I'm guessing maybe in this in this mod they were 100%? Okay. So yeah, not 100% chance to crit. A very, very, very high chance to crit. Because so far, what was that? 1, 2, 3, 4... Five is there five or seven I've seen so far where they did not they all uh, crit and then one of them where they didn't get a smash. Oh, now it's an ant. Oh, that's sad. No one came. 
<laughs> you just say, do not come. Do not come. Oh, baby, offense by five. That's what I like to see. She realized Mare. the power yeah. of mares. I didn't realize before, but I start to realize the power of mares. It, it did take a while to catch on for the, uh, for the fandom. It's true. A whole 12 years. What is that? Does that take 10 magic? Yeah, 10 magic. Oh, I, I can one-hit him now. Nice. The world's most powerful ants. I ate the cupcake 100% not made of anything questionable. Ingredients such as dirt, freshly grown dirt. No, in, in, ingredients. Potato chip. <laughs> Potato chip. Worm. No, it's it's ingredients like uh, vegan yogurt. <laughs> I know what's in it. <laughs> we eat grass and vegan cakes. That's it. Vegan cupcakes. What about birds? Oh, we can't. Eat a baby bird or bird? Oh, that doesn't count. You can't. You can't hold me accountable for whatever I eat when I might be grazing like that. <laughs> can't you see what you're grazing? <laughs> not with these eyes. Oh, it's gonna. Oh, it's not gonna hurt because they're not gonna crit oh. every time. There, see now they're not critting. They ran out of luck. I spoke too soon. Cold remedy in case I get the sniffles. Now you can make lean. talking about oh there's two of them this time give me a free one you're now 10% of the max level Yeah, there's this place always has a little butterfly out here, and it's you can actually like use the butterfly and heal, and then go inside, fight something, come outside, use the butterfly and heal, and you just do this to keep yourself maxed maxed out. We're nice and 100% maxed out. Oh, only one of them. Whoosh. Wow, see, they're, they're not teaming up on me, and this is not good for them. Let's get some free they XP are here. I, I thought oh. that I, I was sitting there like, you know, I'm trying to abuse the location to get a free attack when I stop being flashy, but it's a little bit risky sometimes. And sometimes you accidentally put your hitbox on the back instead of theirs.
But now the ant is eviscerated. Oh, I, I, ooh, there's more. There's more XP to pick up. More XP spawned. How much XP do I need? Uh, I need 300. Ah, oh, 300 something. That's not bad. That's about 10 ants, right? Yeah. Squish, squish, squish. I'm like, I can abuse this by coming outside. And I'm pretty sure because I fought things, it should be back. Oh. The butter I want the butterfly to make me relax. I want it to make me relax. Redux. No redux. But there, there is free XP. Dang it. Oh. Oh well. This poor ant. You can't catch a break. Dumb little ant ant. Alright. Well, let's just move on. One team more ants to squish. <laughs> no, this is I'll why people it. feel like better after a nature walk because you just crush a bunch of ants and, and you're getting level big up a XP. bunch of times. You have big XP. <laughs> if this doesn't level me up, I will go back. I think there's I think this is the boss room. Is there uh, somewhere is there more guys here? No, I'm pretty sure it's the boss room at the top. I'm gonna go ahead and just I need like one more, right? Yeah, two more ants. Oh, speaking oh, of two more right. ants. They waited for you. Now you can magically yeah. make a lean. Oh, hey, well, it's, it's Pinkie Pie. Pie. No, no, now Pinkie Pie wants to have fun with Dinky. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> Alright, you know what? Let's introduce Pinkie Pie to the power of mares. And kill every ant in a 30 mile radius. Oh, dude, I can't move! Do nothing. Oh, he's mares again. Oh, you can use mares if you can't move. Oh, yeah, he's my, I can use my horn, of course. The song. Yeah, the meme song. Yikes, this is hurting. Local confectionery terrorized a child in a nearby cave this evening. <laughs> ah, it was a changeling all along. You won. But at what cost? Oh, she's gone. Yeah, she's, she's gone. Yeah, that was a frightening sprite. Hey, it's the element of, of laughter. It's the element of balloons. The condom water balloon of friendship. <laughs> no, I just think of that, that picture you posted the other day. I don't know the two kids. <laughs> They're holding the... <laughs> Look what we found, guys. We've been empowered by the element of laughter. Ah, oh, see, now they're afraid of me. They run away now. Give me your XP. I think you will eat all the ants. <laughs> uh, only 900 XP? Yeah, I'll, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll eat some ants, get some XP in my way out. Why not? Dinky, what happened to what happened to all the ants in the cave? I, I ate those you. XP. You know what? I'm just gonna use mares. I don't need to conserve power anymore. You, did, you didn't realize that the power of mares was just RGB flashing lights that destroy your um, uh, uh, primary color. The primary pigment colors. So it's it's um, yellow, red, and blue. 
um, flashing lights that just annihilate anything you look at. That's the true power of mares. They're contained in a beautiful form for our safety. Mm, yummy. Uh, hello, rat. <laughs> oh, this one is an instant kill, even with a even with a um, preemptive attack. Oh. That's right, you better run. So we're going to see what happens differently now, because this is different from the, the normal sequence in the game. In the unmodded game, uh, when you come back down here, there's a policeman waiting for you outside there, and he's like, dude, that was supposed to be, uh, there's that sign that says do not enter. It's not just because it was locked, it says you're not supposed to go up there, even though we gave you the key. Uh, and he gets mad at you, and then you have to come back here, and you have to deal with the police in order to be let down <laughs> south to the next town. You have to fight the entire police force. <laughs> you do. But uh, in this game, I guess they don't do that. It's as, as that person was at the library or whatever said, like, hey, you'll notice that there are some differences. Or I guess I guess it was the dog that was channeling the spirit of the mod creator. But as he said, like, there are some differences. There are some differences. You better pay attention. can't believe your dad just dropped you, like, 600. Yeah, Vicky, <laughs> how you doing? Oh, by the way, I just put, like, 500 bucks in your account. Um... Anyway, it's taking away what you've spent so far. Keep telling people I'm a great dad, I'm not putting you in any danger whatsoever. The mayor has to say, maybe she'll talk to me about this? Maybe you'll have a chance to see her flame. Nope, no, no key mark. No, it doesn't say anything. The, maybe so uh, maybe I, I'm thinking they just removed that entirely and I can just go south. We didn't try to go south earlier and see like if there was a roadblock or what was going on. I kind of regret that now. Maybe there was some kind of neat little pony related thing like why you couldn't go south. But um, I guess we'll go check. Maybe we can just go south now. Do I need to heal for free? Yeah. Is the pizza shop open yet? No, nah, I don't think the pizza shop ever opens. Not here, because this is, this is North Ponyville. I'll go ahead and heal for free, why not? And then uh, then we'll go south. Oh no, actually, you're yeah. right. I, you're right, I am supposed to go to, to Twilight, because she, like, she said, after you get the element, come talk to me. Um, I'm going to do my research on where the other elements are and whatnot. Uh, you're right, I should go talk to her. You know what, I'm going to... Sorry, go check the roadblock, please. Yeah, I'm going to check the roadblock, exactly. And then you can tell Twilight about how you went to hang out with Trixie and stuff. Yeah, Trixie. Yeah, you know, friendship ended with Twilight. Now Trixie is my best friend. So say the great and powerful Dinky. Yeah, the great and powerful Dinky. Exactly. Oh, here yeah, it is. There's, there's rocks down here. Rocks. No problem here. <laughs> That's a debris from the meteor? Uh, no, it isn't. Let's read this. No, I want, I want to read. I want to read. Oops. Road to South Ponyville. <laughs> I can go in here. Oh, this is the police department. Guards Pony Department, or whatever.
The tree bird. Hey, it's Applejack! Applejack, whoa! Didn't think we'd be seeing Best Pony this early. <laughs> My friend tried to molest you in a cave? No, that was that was definitely a changeling. Um, I think you're fine. We <laughs> you took Apple Sneed. <laughs> <laughs> I, forgot I forgot about the Sneed. Sneed. Fluttershy hid hers in Manhattan. I don't know exactly where, but knowing her, probably the most isolated place in the city. Applejack volunteered at home. Well, howdy, Miss Diggy. Starlight tells me you need to get to the South Ponyville right away. You're in time. I'm, I'm waiting to clear out that debris right now. Very cool. It's a neat little sequence change from the base game. I like it. Applejack will help you destroy all the rocks. Yes. What do you use that for? What? It's an ugly flavor. I'm sorry. <laughs> Orange. Yummy. Like can you take it by a car? Uh, no, the car should stop. Normal. You can, you can stop uh. him. But you see, where's the car? Car, come on, car. Where's the car? <laughs> Me one looking to get hit by a car. <laughs> yeah, on, can't on. find one. But yeah, you it, got it, 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 it just stops him from moving when you hit him. Uh, oh, yeah. oh. Too oh, that's... I ran, over, ran over by the coke truck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, no. Well, let's see her go. Oh, what? Oh. oh. Yeah, I was thinking, like, am I gonna have to fight the rocks? <laughs> Tom attack! Oh, no! Back. Tom tore into me. I'm gonna die. Let's show Tom the power of mares. <laughs> A loud rumble. <laughs> As many are in this family. <laughs> I ain't never seen rocks do that before. That's cool. That's, yeah, it's a very nice sequence change, and it's it's neat. Like the the the, the scripting, both for the, the well the script, but also um, the scripting in terms of having her be down here and move around and do change stuff. You know, it, it definitely is a lot more work than a lot of other edits, especially with a game like this, where you can just do sprite replacements. Oh, oh look, they came to help even though they're all terrified of you. And well, they should be. I'm squishing them for XP again. The XP literally comes to me. Hey, you got a muffin. Muffins. Mooching off the mice. Please take my son away. <laughs> no, I'll go ahead and take one. Right. Better take one. He is a tough boy. You can treat him as an item. Oh, can you a tough boy? Oh, cool. We got some uh, some hooked on Ken going on now. Yes. Tough boy, tough boy. Shove a mouse into your saddle bag. Exit or Torimoru say. That's a lot of them. All right. Show them the power of mares. Oh. I could, but That's I only good. have one more use of it, and there might be another uh, enemy when I get towards Tonyville South. <laughs> Oh, plus, this way they call for they, they call for more XP to join the battle. 
Ponyville Central is a very uh, violent place. Just like Central America. Oh, wow. <laughs> ah, Shirodo. Oh, see, I, I was thinking of things like this, these mushroom guys. I like this mushroom guy. I don't like the mushroom man. Oh, can you imagine if they edited this to be Shrigma Mare? Oh, maybe I should give that a shot. Oh. Bro, you got off and get that six that HP. Now there's two of them. Yeah, that's why I had to, that's why I had to heal. You know what? I'm just gonna yeah, invoke the power of mass. Mares also make my mushroom stop moving. Okay then. It becomes very still. Wouldn't that be moving now? No, it's, it's 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 scared stiff, man. They're very strong. I like this music too. Ponyville. Octavia. Why does her cutie mark look like a noose? <laughs> You're still in Ponyville. Instead of being a separate town, it's just Ponyville South. Yeah, Ponyville South. Department store. Ooh, Philadelphia to the south. Saw you beat up those ants. Dinky, uh, I heard you with some ants. I uh, deposited 260 bucks in your bank account. Oh, no. So what? Huh? <laughs> hmm? <laughs> Later days, pal. Yo, oh. it's better than my dad. <laughs> Based Easter egg. Now you get a free stay. Do I need a free stay? Eh. I'll go ahead and stay. I want, I want my, my MP back up. It's Sweetie Belle from school. She needs help. I know why she needs help. I played this the other day. She's kidnapped by Lyra. Lyra, you are such a bad pony. I hate alarm clocks. It's terrible pony. Lyra, don't don't kidnap her. That's our good friend Sweetie Belle. <laughs> You're getting into the ship, you stupid fool. What you doing with that Phillies? Oh, it's time oh. for photo finish. <coughs> the ships. <laughs> Photo I can get a I can get a bicycle. I'm not gonna use it very long. I get a bicycle, just just for completion sake. Yes. 
should have just stolen it. <laughs> For liability. Wow, there's a lot of limitations on this fucking bike. It's almost like it's a joke item. It's not a joke item, it's a great item. Check this out. Yeah, you can use it for like five minutes. Look how fast I go. And the music <laughs> rules. <laughs> He's actually just ride the bicycle in the building. Just... I like that. I like how there's no one here. Good old dad. Giving you a thousand dollars. Giving a thousand bits to little Dinky. <laughs> Spoiled kids feeling. Killing things, pigs. I saw you slaughtered the local bowling league. You <laughs> deposited eight hundred dollars in your bank account. Ah, a, a trotcon sandwich, you say? Must be shit. Trot sandwich. <laughs> it only heals about six, <laughs> but it'll have you running <laughs> to the restroom. Now that's the true power. Baseball. Okay, nothing else, right? Uh, toy microphone, baseball, cheap bracelet. Yeah, okay. Neat bracelet. It's 98. It's I, I know. It's not very cheap, is it? I already have it, though, so. It's probably one of those, like, mood rings. The ponies of Human Human Village. You know how to stand up tall. Get it? Yeah, get it? I guess not. Well, baseball get increased offense. Thank you, Mr. T. Very <laughs> cool. Let me use my not joke item bicycle. Now that the haters have left. <laughs> you know, you can ring the bell with the R button. What the fuck? Where did that car come from? <laughs> <laughs> There's no road. Human Human Village, they said they were going to bring something special to the world. That pony driving that car was, had the smuggest grin. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have to live in the worst of... That was like a Sunday drive type of look. Yeah, I live in the shittiest apartment in town to afford this car. What about it? Uh, of course, Octavia likes standing in a queue. She doesn't have her glasses on. Miss Scratch doesn't have her glasses on. These aren't my glasses. Oh, looks like Chris Chen is no longer the mayor. Do you play sports? If you do, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> what an endorsement from the athletic community. Let's go to Everfree Park. Home to famous Everfree Encore. Well, there's like three Mr. T's here. Town. Pet 
ketchup packet. <laughs> I bet, yeah, hot sauce on a, on a muffin would probably work really well. Yeah. That was a really neat system in the game, because, like, I don't really think you need it very often to actually get more out of your healing items, because they already heal for so much. And it's kind of, and you can't control when you use it and whatnot. But yeah, it's a neat thing in the game, if you don't know. Yeah, yeah, this guy describes it, but it's exactly, exactly what he describes. These things are really cheap. You can buy ketchup packet, sugar packet, you know, we all that kind of stuff. And then, like, we gotta eat, try a jar of hot sauce. A jar, I think, was a jar of hot sauce. Yeah, like, with the muffin. Yeah, it's like the next time I eat a muffin, uh, or no, 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 a cupcake. Cupcake, I'll do a cupcake. Cupcake. But next time yeah. I eat a cupcake, I'll automatically sprinkle it on the cupcake, and it can, like, give you a huge increase to how much it heals. Oh yeah, this is a, if you want to sell stuff, you can buy the for sale sign. You can use the for sale sign and people will run up to you on the middle of the street and be like, Yo, are you a shop? You selling something? I'll buy stuff from you. Okay, donkey lady. Freaking mule lady. Uh, I, don't want, I don't want your Trotcon sandwich that's been sitting out collecting flies. Everyone's trying to get rid of their Trotcon sandwiches. I forget which con it was, but they Ooh, had like a bracelet. egg salad sandwich in their lost and found that was there for three days. <laughs> just kind of not refrigerated and just rotting. Yeah, I could see that. And Super sells bananas, I think. Let's see, do they still sell bananas? Take some bananas? You wanna buy some? Do you like bananas? You wouldn't happen to like bananas, would you, kid? Celestia endorsed food. Let's see what it says. Oh man, I'm out of in inventory. Oh, it doesn't, doesn't say anything about it. Very smart. <coughs> um, no. The world's greatest ruler. Do you think it's hot? Yeah, he probably stole the ruler. I'm sure that's what I'm afraid of. Child, like a bully. I can bite. <laughs> My self insert enemy, foe. Why did they attack you? She to make sure I was strong. I let my cabin to Lyra, but after somebody gave her this weird statue and hearing that strange things have been happening there, she may have even kidnapped some pony. You know what? Let's eat that cupcake. Diggy took the jar of hot sauce and used it on the cupcake. It didn't taste very good! What? Non canon. Not canon. <laughs> Stop. Yeah, I mean, uh, banana. How much is it? Hit? 25 hit points. Yeah, 20, 20, 20. Five, it was, it was five bits. That's a pretty good deal. You should put the ketchup packet on the banana. I'm not buying it. Dude, the ketchup packet was like three bits. Or the ketchup packet was like two bits, I guess. The hot sauce was... Yeah, things are very expensive in the steam. <laughs> Thank you, Button Mash. Bon Bon, confectioner. Pinky. Extreme Baker. Oh no. It's Bon Bon!
Just a small investment of two hundred dollars. Oh god. He buys pet alligator gummy. He's blinking at you. So walk in and dig around someone's trash. Take a trip. Take a broken machine. reason making that even worse. I'm hungry too. So can I eat? See, this is a, another example I think of um, where their, their edits to the script of the game is really good. They, that's a really good Pinkie Pie script that they wrote. Feels very much like real Pinkie Pie. Is it ice cream? No, wait, that's not in the game. How about cookie? No. <coughs> Cookies were all turned into muffins in, this, in, the, in the mod. So what is it? We'll give her the banana. A hundred yard waffle last week. <laughs> she also wants two hundred bits. <laughs> so we get the receiver phone. Which, uh, it's like a pager, you can, well, I mean, it's just a one-way phone, I guess it gets audio, but it only receives calls. Got broken machine, a cold remedy, I don't really need that, I'm not gonna need the bicycle very much longer. What does broken machine do? It's a broken machine. It's... Apple Sneed should be able to fix this. Apple Sneed can probably fix it. Let's go to the pizza parlor. I do like pizza, you know, that's my favorite food. We don't sell pizza here. <laughs> <laughs> you got that? Yep, now, we, now you can order pizza. You have to go to a phone, order pizza, and then they deliver it to you, and then you have a pizza item in your inventory you can eat. <laughs> wait, wait, yeah, I need to go to uh, next to the pizza area? Yeah, yeah. Football house. Carousel boutique. Carousel. With Opal. Yeah, and they have little mannequins to replace all the things in here. And here's Spike. He's simping for rarity. Everybody in town knows she's missing people. <laughs> before her, yeah, her rarity does. Like, hey, I heard uh, Swivel got kidnapped. Did you hear Swivel missing? Oh, you're here to see her. Let me let me go see if she's here. But I can't go in her room and take her plush toy. It's cool because plush toy, plush toy, base of a toy owned by Princess Twilight, and what is it? It's Smarty Pants. Plush toy is a really good item because it, um, when you're in combat, anytime somebody attacks, like an enemy attacks, it automatically forces them to target the plush toy before anybody else. And the plush toy has some amount of hit points it can take before it gets turned into a pile of fluff. But very nice, like a big bodyguard you have. I, I can't ride my bicycle anymore though because I have a plush toy. So let's get rid of the bicycle because I never need this item again. Oh wait, is this an enemy? It is, it's a oh, weird, no. it's a pony acting weird. The overreacting citizen. The horror, the horror. Well, if I can return the, site, the bicycle of rice, I have to hold on to it for eternity. He misses some really <laughs> short legs. What the hell was that? 
You're now called Stubby Legs. Grab a water first. If I call home, she should give me the number for the equestrian postal service. Oh, not, no, not bad. Question Postal Service. Is that you, Dinky Muffin? It's your mom, Derpy. I had a few crashes and it hurt my head, but they had me work the storage facility for a little while. What can I do for you? Uh, pick up. <laughs> and now, if I go outside and walk around a little bit, eventually someone will come to, to pick stuff up from me. Exit mouse, I honestly don't need it. Work machine. The exit mouse and the broken machine. Alright. Sweet. Now I have some more inventory space. Now we can go start progressing towards Lyra and the human human valley. To human human valley. Toy. It's just a pile of fluff now.
human human village just across the bridge. Well, they be unbelievable. There's a giant wooden cupcake blocking your path. Oh no. It does sound unbelievable. But it's there. In your path. that mobile receiver. Invincibility uh, hitbox abuse. You get a free attack. Unstop. Oh, the woe of existing. Unable to smash, but just to be smashed. Dinky gets smashed in this game a whole bunch. What's ready? <laughs> yeah, I guess since you were saying earlier, Shade, like, man, what? why did she attack you? The idea is you're kind of supposed to figure out first that Rarity suspects that she kidnapped Sweetie Belle and you go try to confront her in the park and she fights you and then says, yeah, I was just fighting you to, to like size you up, but I did not, I, I am a suspicious person, but I did not kidnap her, Lyra did. <laughs> but I just went straight to her. Uh, oh yeah, and I need to go to, Pink oh wait, actually, instead of going to Pinkie Pie, I want to go get, I think that if I go to Bon Bon right now, Bon Bon will give me an item. Because, yeah, uh, Pinkie Pie said, hey, you need to come talk to me. Because, I, yeah, so Bon Bon's standing outside. Ah, I need a kiss. I'm looking for Pinkie Pie. She's in Everfree Park. Okay. And, yeah, Magic Caramel should just yeah, replenish his MP. Makes you need a kiss. There's gummy still. Chewing on a toy ball. Hi, name one. Oops, I mean, hi, Dinky. Lol, funny joke. Meta move. Uh, actually, I tried a cupcake with hot sauce just a little bit ago, and it, the game informed me that it did not taste super de duper delicious. <laughs> Bajillion times as much hot sauce. Put hot sauce on top of it. It's so spicy, even Pinkie Pie can barely eat it. Fire started shooting out of her mouth and burned a bunch of wooden statues she had nearby for some reason. I bet Dinky would love it. That's why I invited you here. I got the hot sauce cupcake. So defeat is it in a forest. Or Twilight's library. 
Hot sauce cookie, Pinkie Pie's invention. I'm willing to set off a pour in hot sauce on our cupcakes. Pinkie Pie has baked the hot sauce right in. It's so spicy, just a tiny bit makes you breathe fire. Now we can go breathe fire to destroy the wooden cupcake. Or muffin or whatever it was. Oh no, I'm feeling strange. Did they add the mushroom onto your pony? Yeah, I have the one? mushroom on my head now. I can't continue my quest. I have to go to the hospital. I need to go see a healer. And who's the healer? Zakora. We haven't gone to the hospital. We, we haven't seen Nurse Redheart yet. She's still cute. But uh, we also haven't seen Zakora yet. So I'll just spoil it for you and tell you that the mystic healer is Zakora. Because in this game, each uh, hospital... The hospital takes the place of like the equivalent of like the um, the chapel or whatever it is in uh, like Final Fantasy and uh, uh, Dragon Quest. You know, where if, if an enemy, if, if your party member gets defeated, you have to go to the holy man there and have him resurrect them. Um, they do the same thing here. If it, if an ally gets defeated, they just get defeated and knocked unconscious, and you come find them at the hospital. They were rushed to the hospital, um, so they replace that with I don't know, I don't know, with uh, Nurse Redheart. Uh, they can all, the hospital can also cure you of other things like poison and stuff like that. But if it's a magic illness, then the hospital can't help you. They need to outsource it to a different healer like Zakora here. And so each hospital always has like this mystic man sitting in the lobby of the hospital. Like, I'm not actually part of this hospital. I'm just a mystic healer who hangs out to try to help people who modern science can't heal. Uh, so they replaced her with Zakora, and so Zakora is all rhymy. When strange illness leaves you weak, Zakora is the one you see. Um, and because I have a magical mushroom growing on my head, it, one thing it does is it screwed up, it periodically and randomly screws up all of your uh, directional controls. So which is why I all of a sudden started walking all wonky once I entered the hospital. It randomly decided to like reverse up and up, turn up into left and right into down and stuff like that. Uh, so she'll remove it, but she'll actually pay you, which is nice, because she likes the mushrooms. Anything else, if you get like possessed by a spirit or you get like um, turned to diamond, um, she can revive you from those. And that she charges a fee for. But, um, the mushrooms she actually likes, so she will buy them from you. Well, they make an excellent pizza topping. They do. I love mushrooms. I like eating mushrooms. Dex. I just wish I had some way to get rid of it other than that, because like if we get halfway through the valley towards Happy Happy or um, Human Human Village, and then uh, we get a mushroom on our head, we can't do anything about it. We have to walk. We would have to walk all the way back here. The disco pony. Well, you can make it all the way to the to to Happy to the Human Human Village and. Uh... Yeah, I'm saying, there. That, that's what I mean, but like, you know, I, I, I can't like buy a, a healing item and I can't just have like a healing spell for it because I only have heal, yeah. the first level of heal. They do not have auto circumcisors in the shop. Automatic circumcisors? Yeah. Sadly, there's no, there's no, uh... Maybe, maybe they can go ask, store. well, I did meet Pinkie Pie, maybe they can go ask Pinkie Pie if uh, she, she knows the guy that, you know, maybe... Some guy who who might um, you know cuck her other admirers with her with he might know of a place where they sell automatic circumcisors. Yeah. <clears throat> but uh, luckily, I think we're in the we're still in the the canon seasons here. Yeah, that's true. It hasn't happened. She, she, she still might know him. Right? Or wait, wait, actually, when does when does Weird Al first show up? Season four. I have no idea. I think, I think he shows up in the middle of season four.
Let's see. Yep, season four. Yep. All right, here's that thing. Is this a muffin or cupcake? A giant wooden cupcake. All right, goods. Uh, hot sauce cupcake. Upon taking a small nibble, flames burst from her mouth and incinerated the wooden cupcake. Oh, I was going to say that there's nothing up here, but uh, yeah, there's a picture of it. A picture taken by Photo Fish. Photo Fish? Kill the, well, fighting one of them on his own isn't necessarily that bad, but when you kill it, it, uh, no. When you kill it, it explodes and it does like a bazillion damage to you. Burst into flames, did 262 damage. But, because we have the little rolling hit points, the combat ended before the damage finished getting applied. Oh, you know what? Life up. I get uh, that cassette. Uh oh. Yucks. Uh, no. Wow. Our dad. The moment we got a, a like a cellular receiver telephone, our dad starts abusing it and calling us while we're out on an adventure, we're telling us we should stop and take a break and save the game. No, dad. Oh no, oh no, two UFOs! Little UFO, let's just use mares. Nighttime stuffiness, now I have a cold! Sneeze, more hit points. <laughs> no, uh, welcome back. Thank you. Yeah, so uh, I'm, I'm sniffling, it gave me a cold. Good thing I have a cold remedy. <laughs> he got over the cold. It's Ramio from Evan Go. This it's spinning robo. Or in the original Japanese version, just spin. Spin. Yeah, his name is just spin. Oh, you give me a cold again? See, this is what I think, which I, I, I don't know why you're saying, uh, maybe, maybe it goes through shields or something, but like I have the, they have the baseball item equipped, which is a throwing instead of a regular item, uh, or it's a shoot item or whatever, and it has like really low accuracy. It does do more damage than the, the like bulk rate box that I had, but it, it misses so often. So yeah, I, I can cure using the healing, I can cure my, my cold. I got her with the cold. Get a cupcake. Three plants. Yeah, that's why I'm gonna use mares. Because otherwise, they, it's not it's not even like using MP really, because they're probably just gonna drain my MP. I kill them all, so it doesn't matter. Oh, see, there you go, they're draining it. Oh my gosh, six. This sucks. Oh no! I need to be that kasu. <laughs> Oh, where's the old babies? Where's the old babies? I need the old baby offense went up. <laughs> yeah, it does look like that. Maybe that goes through the shield because that uh, still did like max damage. Normally a shield causes you to do half as much. This luck capsule. No, 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 not that the, how it works now. Not the tree thing. Not the tree. Not the tree. I despawned him.
My internet is acting really messy right now. A croissant. Let me see if I can fix that. There's a bomb inside. Dinky takes it. Okay, Dinky. Okay. I mean, I, I, I heard that. GC, it. a bomb. Just opens it up. What's that? Yeah. Uh, Mr. Uh, there's a, there's a, uh, excuse, D Dinky, I'm from the Question Postal Service. Uh, Mr. Kaz... 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 This guy tried to send you a package. <laughs> it has a bomb in it. Let's try out the bomb. Okay. Uh, but I assure you, it's a present. <laughs> Set real fast. I'll be right back. It's a human cosplay. Isn't it a human cosplayer? Is that what this is? Yeah, human cosplayer. Their mighty hand.
long fight with a lot of XP probably. Yeah, 1400 XP. Oh baby, offense up by four. That's what I was looking for. Our group goes out and yells at ponies who express dissenting opinions. Please donate. I'll just stalk you all over town until you donate. Return. We're getting slapped by the mighty hands of human cosplayers. Uh, in Valley Philly Town. Yes, there are friends in Philly Town. I want to go to Philly Town. Back to having internet work. Just, just barely. Keep getting slapped by the human cosplayers' his mighty hands. We need to get ponies in person. Find out, is there is there is there a telephone anywhere in this freaking town so I can call my dad and save the game? So uh, it looks like the reason I talked to somebody in town. And they said, yeah, there's this really powerful gem in the Eastern Cave. It's the, it's the element of harmony, of course. And uh, as as we were told before by Twilight Sparkle and others, um, any kind of uh, bad evil person can't get through to the elements of harmony where they're they're at and so uh, lyra said she found there they said that lyra found out that rarity was able to go through the cave probably at the time that she went through there to hide her element there and uh, lyra wants to get to the cave to get to the power in there and that's why she kidnapped sweetie bell is she's trying to she, she can't get rarity she's going to try to get at rarity's sister and see if she can get through maybe let's buy an egg uh, no i don't want to buy a fresh egg actually because a fresh egg i want a boiled egg but not a fresh egg Plus, fresh egg would be weird, right? Like, what, are we, ponies going to eat chicks or something like that? That would be weird.
That's kind of neat. Like the, the self-service stand, they tell you the prices, and they also give you the option for how much do you actually want to pay at the self-service stand. You can choose Wait, to just, like steal from it. Is this what is this? This is a uh, Equestria Bound. It's a a like a ROM hack, a mod for Earthbound. Holy shit! We're currently in Human Human Village, where Lyra has kidnapped Sweetie Belle and her and her cult of human cosplaying fanatics are trying to stop us from rescuing her. Oh. I never played this. Uh, did you ever play Earthbound or Mother 2? Uh, I never played Mother 2. I played a little bit of Earthbound. Uh, it's the same game. Mother 2 is so the time. English localized, localized name. Oh. Same game. Alright, so I got um, all this. This might be fun to do during MLP con for other people who haven't seen it. Uh, well, we're, we're recording right now, and we'll be oh, uploading these online. Oh, we are? I'm online. sorry. No, that's fine. Jeff Oops. specifically wanted to be in a, a public channel so people can hang out with us or join in and talk. But yeah, we're recording yeah. this, and we're putting, uh, putting these... Let's, uh, let, let's play game, you know? Oh, you're putting it up on Play Mm-hmm. We will be once we... Okay. We're, we're, we're not doing a stream of it. We're just going to record it and then put it up. Oh, are you putting it up on the slash MLP channel? Uh, yeah, probably. Okay. Those human cosplayers look... Oh, they're ponies. Yeah, they're ponies cosplaying as humans. I get it now. It's hard to tell, you know, with their mighty hand and all. Yeah. With their what? <laughs> this is what they slapped hand. with their mighty yeah. hand. Good lessons being learned here. You can if if someone's acting weird, just beat them up, and then they'll turn back to normal. Yeah, that's better than the lesson earlier of when you if you encounter an adult like daring if you encounter an adult if she's cool enough like daring do and she invites you into her shack on the mountain and asks you to go into the hole in her basement, just do it. She probably has cool treasure to show you. Yeah, there's probably a statue down there. Oh no, some Paris sprites. I don't like Paris sprites because they can steal, they can, they can eat your stuff. Okay, this is getting really freaking annoying. All I need to do is hit them once and they will die. It, it's mine. A big smile Duh. on its face. There's a muffin. Okay, here's where Sweetie Belle is. There she is. Sweetie Belle, who? Dinky? Dinky, I knew you'd come. I'm not very good at magic yet, but I felt like I got through to you. We should go, but the door won't open. I bet Lyra has the key. Get it from her, then we can head back to Rarity's house. When she took me, Diamond Tiara mentioned that Lyra can control lightning. I have no idea why, but... Uh, so you want this. Fudulu left it at my house. Ah, good, good name choice. Yes. Let's wait here until you return. Yeah, so we got the, the weather badge. Is it, is it an equipped with item or do you just hold it? Just I think by keeping it, it deflects light attacks. Can you still equip it though? No. Hat. That likes has got a bracelet. Body has travel charm. Okay. Oh no, it's Diamond Tiara. Uh, I sure hope I'm not low on health right now. I don't think I recovered from that last... I'm at 92. That's okay. We'll show yeah, the power you're, you're of mares! Oh, oh yeah, but even if I can't move, I can still use magic. This is my horn. Very nice. Alright. Ah, oh, easy fight. The power of mares has saved me. Yes, yet again. A very good favorite thing. Oh, it ran really fast. Yeah, Diamond Tiara runs. She run. All right, now that I got the weather badge, we can go confront Lyra. Game so 
laggy. Too many enemy sprites for SNES. <coughs> Was it doing this on the original hardware too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if you, if you played the original game, like you know, there are certain this area, um, like in in Ponyville, when you're outside the arcade with Trixie's goons, uh, that place always lags really bad. Oh yeah. Like some people might not like it, and be like, oh, it's lagging. That's not good. But I'm like, dude, this is it, it, it's soul. It's exactly what the game's supposed to feel like. I know. It, it, oh, nice. Going to attack. I cast Transmute Pony to XP. Uh, oh, uh, oh just like, just like my just favorite three alchemy. More. Three more. I should love, I'll probably get the other one just inside of the uh, the main building where fire is. How much does banana heal for? 35? Yeah, something like that. 25, that's not very good actually. That's pretty terrible. Okay. Yeah, but the shop didn't have... Oh, I think that the the, the drug the actual drugstore shop, though, not the little self-service shop, but the main one might actually have something to do. All right, croissant, that's pretty good. That's 68 points. Watching all. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Yeah, they're, they're, uh, they're a whole bunch of uh, human cosplayers who are making a big summoning circle to summon humans from the great dark beyond. It's a cult. Although, as he said, it's much less of a summoning circle and more of a summoning blob right now. But once they get the circle shape, it's over. Whoa, Dinky's legal now. Oh, she's 18? Yes. How nefarious. <laughs> I waited 18 levels for this! I think he ate the banana. The no standing zone. Trot sandwich? I like the oh, trot, trot, trot con sandwich. You got the runs. Excuse me, I need there we go. He's gonna try to sacrifice me to summon a human? Oh sick. Slapped with their money. I mean humans would do the same. Humans would some would sacrifice a human to summon a pony. Yes. Sounds right. Yeah, it was worth a shot. Alright, and then we're laggy right here as well. Laggy, laggy, laggy. Okay, we're good through, okay. Oh, there's the circle. Yeah, yeah, Humani Fthagen. Does that work? I feel like we most successfully had some sort of chant. But let's see, so my stats, uh, I have a few hit points and I, I can also use some magic. We need that magic caramel. And then, uh, banana, croissant. No, oh, I like the banana. Max hit points. Alright. Well, let's, let's challenge Lyra. And bring the humans to our world. Won't you help me? Uh, yeah, no, wait. Oh, shoot. I said yes. I meant to say no. Crap. Why? You've been sitting here. Stop me. me. Oh, man. Oh, good thing I got that weather badge from Foodaloo. Lyra's lightning was reflected by the weather badge. Oh, I, I'm, yeah, I'm sort of supposed to say no. I want to stop her. And I accidentally said yes and tried to help her. Why wouldn't you want to help Lyra? What's that in her hoof? Is it a is it a gun? <laughs> I, think, I think it's like a cyborg hand. Ah, uh, shield. I'm gonna I'm gonna shield myself. Thank <laughs> you. 
wire a club beat. <laughs> it, is good, it is good music. Oh, yeah, but it is. Your shield disappears, which should be like the last time. Oh, okay. I was gonna oh, use mares on her. I was gonna use mares on her, but I didn't even need to. The real mares were the ones inside. Ever since I got this oh, statue, I've had dreams, visions. I saw something I've always thought about, but now it's more real. I could almost reach out and touch them. I've done things I shouldn't have, went too far. I even filly napped some pony. I'm keeping her in the cabin in the woods. Take this key and go save her. I need to go figure out what I should do with my life now. Alright, got the key. So you fought Miss Lyra and beat her? Now what do we do? Maybe we should get some sort of chant. Hello, dinky friendship. <laughs> Everybody left. At this point, it's more of something triangle. Just the three of us left. Oh, and the presents are still here, so I, could, I didn't need to go through the maze and get the presents. Guess having that many was in one room is a violation of the fire code anyways. That really is the day three. Uh, the day four. It's the day three things. of the con, yeah. Yeah, you go to the con. <laughs> a moment ago, it was packed in here with all the cosplayers. Now there's like three cosplayers left. There's some there's some open <laughs> presents on the ground. You you. This is the music. This this yeah. This right here is the music that you hear. <laughs> Monday morning at the con. That's what it sounds like. I can go rest for free. Uh, let's let's go get this. Uh, let's go get swivel. Diamond Tiara stole all the food. Due to personal reasons. Due to personal reasons, we will now be going out of business. Not today, Paris Sprites. Behold, mares. Behold, mare. Rated good. It did not work. Mares did not work on the Paris Sprite. Oh my gosh. Well, I mean, it's grinning big, so it must have worked. Yes. Oh, well, I guess not. I, it doesn't matter what you say, she just says, oh, and does that. Key to the cabin. Oh, it's a harmony? Well, we already hit her and it came over there. It's on the east side of town. We could go check it out before we leave. Sweetie Bill joined you. She has a bread roll and a plush toy. Oh, dude, she doesn't even have any weapons or anything. Okay. No wonder she keeps dying. <clears throat> well, let's give her a quick level up by killing some enemies. <laughs> Did not repeat Paris Bright. Nicest music to kill bugs too. Yeah, it's it's stomp, the Paris Bright music. Oh, photo finish time. Ah yes, that pose, the lighting, the location. It's brilliant, brilliant. I am photo finish the Equestria's pose most fashion photographer. It's time to make this imagines. I go. <laughs> I 
Someone's over here in the drugstore. Yo, Dad, I deposited 626 bucks into your bank account. You now have 1,600 bits. All right, let's see, we need some equipment. A toy microphone. Who will carry this burden? Sweetie Belle's offense goes up. Uh, what else we need? Sweetie Belle needs a copper bird. Oh, I can't. Uh, you don't have enough money? Sweetie Belle needs a home set. supplies do they have? Consumables. Cold remedy, your fishing herb. Oh, they sell croissants here. Those are good. I'll buy a couple croissants. Muffin, muffin. Okay, I'll buy a croissant for her. You know, I will sell you. You, you want to buy some muffins, Mr. Store Clerk? Hey, look, 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 look. Yeah, I can buy them. $3. Ice cold the muffin, $3. The same price as a ketchup pepper. <laughs> I'll trade you this muffin for one ketchup packet. No, I don't know about myself. I'll sell the other muffin. We need to level up Sweetie Belle a bit, but it's hard to level up Swivel because, well, in this, so this is the cave, like the next dungeon. This is where the next element of harmony is hidden. Uh, if we go into here and J if she gets attacked, she'll die. Although we do have the plush toy. The plush toy might give us enough buffer to get some, some XP. Damn. Swivel strong? Uh, well, she knows magic, so... Now she knows fire as well. He just put that mole on ice. Yeah, but she also only has 29 hit points and really low defense, so if, if the mole attacks her, she would probably just die in one hit. <laughs> as I recall from playing this at Winnie City the other day, uh, I think there's a sweater actually uh, in one of the. There's a present with a sweater in it in uh, this cave. Which you're gonna equip on, on Swivel. Level it up. Well, she better level. It's, this is one of those games where instead of starting the character, like, oh, we'll have to start at you know, level 9, because that's about right for where you are, or like, oh, we'll have them start, it'll calculate based on your current level. Or it'll take your current XP pool. Nope, it starts at level one, baby. All right, so here's a gun, and I need you to go kill that thing real fast. Yeah, so it's a and you're gonna feel body. great. Yeah, so sweater, <laughs> sweater give me one extra defense and a lot of sp yeah, and five extra speed. Um, but I have the travel charm. I'll just get equipped. I don't really care. Swivel needs the defense and the speed. With with the speed, it also helps Swivel cast her spells faster, so we can guarantee to get a bigger hit in, I guess. All right. Ooh. Bats. Bat door. See, that one hit almost killed her. Almost. No. Oh.
Put them all on ice again. Easy. Easy levels. Easy, buddy. Oh wow, she actually doesn't gain a level from that. She's she's past past the point of getting levels from single enemies now. Stay, but the beds are still sized to fit a human. We might have to replace them. Just try not to think about it too much. <laughs> uh, all those human cosplayers striking me with their mighty hands. If only we didn't stop Lyra, then maybe the portal would have opened. What does this guy say? This is the guy who said, like, admitted that he had uh, help, helped kidnap Swivel. Uh, little bad pony? Yeah, you admitted to kidnapping Swivel with Lyra and Diamond Tiara. But it was for po it was for humans to enter Equestria. A very righteous cause. Hmm. And as a bonus, you get to make Rarity uncomfortable. What, it made Rarity uncomfortable? Uh, yeah. Rip plush story. I think he thought about eating pizza and started craving it. These are some funny looking bats. They're fruit bats. Oh. Right, like, like in the, the episode with the fruit bats? Did, did they look this red? Well, these are strawberry ones. Oh, all the more better. Just, just squish them all. <laughs> I just... 
home and get all my homesickness. Being homesick, I guess there may be times like this. That's what big sisters are for. Even if there's crazy stuff going on, remember I'm always there for you. So you feeling better? I better get going. I got a doctor's appointment. Alright, good. I gotta work That's all it takes. <laughs> yep. Just call call home. Don't talk to your mom. Just talk to your sister. Let's see how far we can go through this cave now. Can I get all the way? I mean, what level is this? Level at? Ten? Yeah, she needs a bit more, but she'll get it as we go through the cave. <laughs> the mole is being an idiot. <laughs> Ah, she learned the next level of Ice Spell. That's what we need. Lucky! It's nice. This is very lucky so far. I haven't used any magic and have gotten every single attack dodged or missed. All you have to do is just keep hitting them. Oh nice, they can defeat me from a hit sometimes? Pretty good. Oh, they replaced the bear sprite with a, you know, MLP style bear. Mighty bear. The mighty bear. That rocks. Maximum MP went up by eight. I, I guess all of a sudden we're uh, we're playing uh, Guilty Gear. That rocks. Yeah. All right now, oh, now we're fighting a bunch of enemies. 
Well, we'll show these enemies the power of mares. thought about what he was doing and freaked out. Yeah, when they do that, it doesn't even give them any benefit. All it does... Ooh. See that? Cause all it does is give them negatives. It just... It just, <laughs> it, it just, it just gives them confusion. It's not like... Why a, am I... Gives them plus damage and confusion. Nope, just confusion. <laughs> <laughs> why am I why am I doing this fight? I'm gonna die. <laughs> Dang, I was hoping not to hoping to take no damage from Scribble, that's alright. We should eat a croissant. The max. Oh baby, offense up by four. I love the oh babies on offense. Sweet! Hit points went up by 38. Holy cow. Where's this croissant? I love the way this mole looks. The mole does have you energy for sure. Definitely your kind of little mole guy. <laughs> the fruit bat size of the situation started feeling a little bit strange about what it's doing. <laughs> yeah, it, when I don't just insta kill the bear with the ice attack, it definitely does uh, run the risk of actually taking damage. That probably wasn't good. Well, there can't be much more in this cave, I don't think. Like... Yeah, there's a little bit more. Winters come early, bear. The world's toughest fillies getting mauled by bears and being like, eh, I'll just eat a bagel. Ooh, magic caramel, very nice. I was just thinking, like, this, the, 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 the unfortunate thing is I have no way to recover MP. Now I got a magic caramel. What? Dinky's homesick again? I just not... got over homesickness. Look, I can't blame her. I'm also thinking about her mom. Homesick! She's homesick again! Dude, I'm not gonna be able to beat Rarity with being homesick. Dang, I should've just used life up. 
Now I waste that croissant out. Ugh, this is not gonna go well. Okay. <laughs> We need to be to be punished. Ah, uh, rarity. Ah. Uh. See, she started about, thought about pizza instead of casting shield. Yeah, six hit points. That's not good. Just the nick of time, though. That is true. That was very good. See, Storm would be good, but it, it rarely hits. But if it hits, it'll do a lot of damage. Damn. Yeah, she just. This homesickness is gonna destroy us. <laughs> Rarity being friendly and affectionate? That can't be right. No, 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 we, we can't, oh, we can't, oh, not fast enough. Well, Dinky, it's all up to you. Use the power of mares. Good job, Rarity. <laughs> using that. Oh my gosh. She does so much damage. Yeah. Dude, this is, this is freaking stupid. Why did she get homesick after, uh, like, three battles? of just getting over being homesick. That's, that's, that's a bug. That's, that's, that's bad programming right there. That's a problem. It's a bug game. Oh, wait. Whoa, whoa, I come back. My friend's still... Okay, well, time to go see Nurse Red... <laughs> Good excuse to go see Nurse Redheart. I'm not complaining. Well, nurse, my friend's kind of dead, but uh, I, I need to get checked out, too. I need to do some checking out myself. <laughs> no, not you. I want the nurse. So, you're making me pay $35 to get it, to have you check me out? <laughs> I can check out each of you fillies for 35 bucks. <laughs> so as I recall, when you when you're defeated in battle like that and you recall and you just continue, um Let's see, yeah, the goods are all gone. Yeah, those are all used up just like you expect. Um, and, but what happens is you lose half of the money you had. So like I only have 160, well I paid a little bit, but so I, I went down to like 200 and something bits because I was defeated. But the money in your bank, I think the money in your bank stays how it is. You don't lose any money in your bank. Or maybe yeah. I'm wrong, maybe you lose the money in your bank too. I don't know, but, but that, that, that's the advantage That'd be of weird. keeping it in the bank. <laughs> Yeah, hey, see, kid. I, I didn't lose any money heard you got wiped out. <laughs> 800 bucks. Apple Sneed picked up the receiver? No, Apple Sneed did not. I'm, 
not I'm not homesick anymore. Oh, I was cured. Being defeated cured me of my homesickness. Okay. Getting your shit kicked in uh, gives you other things to think about. Let me go ahead and buy some uh, croissants. Probably after this, uh, after this cave would be a good stopping point. Yep, that's what I was planning on. Sounds well, good. and I was planning on the cave being over, like, now, but instead we got defeated by homesickness. <laughs> we were the, our own orphan the whole time. I, I do wish that Sweetie Belle could actually do something against Rarity, because the problem is Rarity has, like, massive resistance to freeze, and freeze is your single target ability. That's why like, I used I used the freeze beta and it did like 16 damage. A real beta attack for sure. And it's I because Rarity has a cold heart. So yeah, she, she, she has a cold heart, so you can't do much with Ice Fury. The fire damage, um, you know, she takes normal damage from it, but fire is very weak because it's like a big AoE attack. It hits a whole row of enemies, so it generally doesn't do very much compared to the other attacks. And I only have the first rank of it. So the only thing you can really do with Swivel is you can cast the Lightning ability, and if it hits, you know, Lightning always does a lot of damage. I don't know if she's weak to it or not, but I know that it does, a, it does like 100 and something damage. It'll do over 100 to her. But it has such a low chance of hitting. It only has like, you know, a 25% chance or something of actually hitting when you cast it. So with Sw you pretty much have Sweetie Bell just keep casting it. And if it, if it hits her during the, the encounter, then you probably win the encounter because it has a huge amount of damage. If it never hits her, then good luck. You kind of lose. I don't like that about it. The Gambling. Oh, relax. Yeah, relax. Oh, that, that poor mole playing absentmindedly lit on fire. <laughs> Eviscerated. I never noticed that it kind of echoes a little bit in the in the cave. Yeah, it's neat. Ah, uh, the bear is being absent-minded on the world map, so I get the green. Goodbye, bear. Mighty bear. Not mighty enough. Swivel three away from Weagle. How many uh, elements do you need to collect in this game again? It's like six. So there's eight spots in the original game. Um, this one, there's there's six elements, of course. I and like in the, when you use the uh, the dormant element, it shows you eight. So I'm assuming that there's just, they have some kind of lore explanation for what the extra two are. They're probably not elements. It's probably like you complete the elements and then you need to do something else, or you need to go to get the princesses, you know, Celestia and Luna or something like that. I don't know, though. I'm excited to find out. 
uh, rarities up there, that cold-hearted bitch. Sweetie Belle, following in her footsteps, had mastered the power of ice. Oh, hello. Wow, we, we say rarity that cold-hearted bitch is up there. Mimli is connected. Yeah. <laughs> God, I fucking hate rarity. Oh, Sweetie Belle, what are you doing in such an awful place? And get your maiden coat absolutely filthy. Run home and clean yourself this instant. No, stay. I'm not even gonna let you pass. Are you punished. Fucking Christ. Please tell me you have to fight her. Beast. 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 Just as menacing as you expect. Yeah! <laughs> oh, hit her, hit her, hit her! Dang it! Oh wow, that's that's not good. What? Yes, hit her! Look, like 156. That's a lot. Oh shit! See you, sweetie oh, Bell. Oh my. <laughs> uh, maybe, maybe you can get one more cast off before you die. Oh, brilliant. Good job, Swivel. Oh, that's cool. Like, that, the HP goes down, but you still have chances to attack before it. Like, mm -hmm. You also have chances to, to heal uh, in between that happens. And if you finish combat before it happens, it stops and you still... Uh, you just It stops wherever it was. You didn't have all the damage applied. That That's such a neat mechanic. Oh no, no, no. Okay, that's bad. See, that's what I can do. Yay. Alright, how do you like the power of mares, though? Only 69. Nice, but not nice enough. <laughs> Dinky realized the power of mares. Beta. Beta. <laughs> God, I love seeing rarity disappear like that. That's right. And now all the enemies in the cave are afraid of us because we have defeated Rarity. <laughs> they, they will all run away if I approach them. It's gonna be like a... Hey, you defeated the person that they're probably guarding. Like, why would they fucking fight? Yeah. Well, so if you're too strong, if they can tell you're strong, they'll also run away. But if once you defeat the end, no matter how strong you are, they'll automatically run away from you. It's like they're, yeah. since they're since they're facing away, whenever I touch them, uh, I'm touching them from the back, so I get the green swirl and I get a, a free attack on them. Oh, nice. And now they burn. And if you're um, strong enough, then it, it won't even have you fight them. It'll just go and give you a free victory instantly. When you, it, it usually can only happen if you're on a, if you're a, um, like a one v one, 
But th I bet you like one of those fruit bats. If I touch one of those fruit bats and there's only one of them, it'll just give me an instant victory right now because they're so weak. And the other one wants to come help. Yeah, they, they want to come help and then all they want to do is run away, you know? This guy, this should give me an instant victory. Yes. <laughs> Time to farm XP. Oh baby, offense. Oh baby, defense. That rocks. Maximum MP went up by 10. And left a present. There was a croissant. Ah, oh, get some XP from this guy. <laughs> Where did the Philly touch you, sir? Oh, that's a that's not a green one. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna come out here and rest, and then save the game, and that'll be it for today. We found Princess Luna from the future, having shapeshifted herself into a little insect thing. We have we we had Diamond Ta Tiara get canonically uh, beat by her father. We went into Daring Do's basement, where nobody could hear what was happening. Yeah, and uh, we got Pinkie Pie's element. We got Rarity's element. We rec rescued Swivel from. Lyra and her human human cult in human human village. We put an end to the cultists and their summoning blobs so they couldn't summon humans or whatever they were gonna do. And it's pretty good. Now we have to go back next time on Equestria Bound. We have to go back to um, South Ponyville and we're going to have to uh, get Vinyl Scratch out of debt. You should probably put a save state in too, just in well, case also, the save doesn't work properly. Yeah, I know. I was thinking about that. Let me do that real quick. We should all. We also though. Also, what happened? As the recap is, we also got our fucking flanks kicked by a stupid bush, bullshit bugged homesickness that happened twice, even though it shouldn't have. Oh yes. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. I didn't <laughs> rename that. It's just named please work <laughs> after you did the manual hack to it. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna yeah, go in here and say save, and then we're gonna say Great Record Adventure to this point. Good night, sleep tight, and we're a great team. Well, you should probably turn the power off instead of just pressing reset. Alright? Alright. All right.